Hello, it's the Yak. Welcome back. Roback.com, R-H-O-B-A-C-K.com. Promo code Yak, 20% off your first purchase. Q-Zips, polos, hoodies, joggers, shorts. Mm-hmm. Happy birthday, Kyle. Did you think I wasn't going to say oh, happy birthday I, to you? I actually birthday. thought you I kind of have been shunning you. You have. I wanted to save it. Yeah, thank you so much. I have a surprise. Oh, my Uh-oh. God. Uh-oh. I have a surprise. Tangible. Uh-oh. Kyle is the hardest man in the world to buy something for. Agreed. I had a hell of a morning trying to figure it out. Okay. At one point, I was going to buy you Thanks an air fryer. And then I was like, he'll be like, what the fuck? Yeah. Like, you think I'm going to get fat? I looked at a $700 scooter. And then I had the oh. thought that, like, if you get hit by a car while riding this, then I'll never forgive myself. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I get it. Um, I would have loved that, by the way. And fuck. the air fryer, to be honest. Really? Yeah. You would have liked the air fryer? Yeah. Okay. Well, I did get you a mystery box. Oh. Created by myself. Okay. Wow. <laughs> and let's just put out there that, I, again, you were very hard to buy for, so it was kind of a prey and spray situation. Mm-hmm. Okay, this is items that you purchased or you purchased. gathered. You but forged. the mystery box Purch- itself oh is more of the present than whatever's in it. Yeah. Right? Because like, there's a lot of r- yeah, random things. Not knowing what. It yeah, no, be. I love that. Okay. Yeah. I'm a, yeah, I'm a fan of the gamble. Yes. Yeah. All right, so, so Paige, I think Paige will I'll text her right now, she'll bring it in. But I want you to, I wanted you to have a special birthday a mystery box. That means a lot. Yes. I was very excited that mm-hmm. uh I mean you, you know I love you. I don't want to get sent. And we all we all I love you. Yep. In this. I love nope. you guys. I actually we Mark all and Brandon in? did nothing for this. Yep. Oh, well, we were live we, we, when while you were putting and I, together. And I want to just say it on the record, I kept the receipt in case you want to return anything. Once you yep. see the number of how much money that. I spent, oh your eyes God. are going to pop out of your head. Jesus Christ. Yeah. And Mark and Brandon did. We did. We chipped in. No, we chipped in. Yeah. Dan Dan said, I'm going to do this. <laughs> and I was like, that's a great idea. Yeah. That was my I said ditto. Yeah. Hey, thank you guys. You know you guys can get him? You get him the sun lamp. Done. Yeah, go get ahead, Get sun lamp on Yeah, get your sun lamp. Uh, I think oh, that was so just the weed withdrawals, to be honest. I okay. Back to normal. It could still. Be I walked into Best Buy and I asked for a sun lamp, and they looked at me like I was the dumbest person. <laughs> in the world. Yeah, is that? A I thing? was like, you know, a lamp that that mimics the sun, and they're like, what? Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. So yeah, that sucked. That was okay. a bad experience. So you actually tried to get the sun lamp? I did try. Is this a common thing? I don't know. Oh, the second, the actual Google that pops up is sun lamp for seasonal depression. Yeah. Yeah, that maybe feel, it would help. That's an know. autofill. I can do that on the own some. The what? On my own. <laughs> hey, I have a question uh, while we wait for the mix- mystery box. I was out yesterday. Um, Brandon, this guy, Vince McMahon, is he important to wrestling? He was uh, back in the day. It's been a you're while. You're a big fan of his. Come on in, Paige. Come on in, Paige. You're a really big you fan got that, of his. Uh, yeah. Taller it's a mystery box. Thank mystery you, box. Mystery box. Was he uh was he important to the history of Thank wrestling? You. Back early in the 80s and stuff. Uh, he now, when you, when you told me last week there's never been a better time to get into WWE, is this what you had in mind? Well, he's it's not really affiliated with WWE anymore. Okay. He's been out for a while, so he's not okay. He's not really a, a key figure anymore. At, at all. Oh, no. that's weird because I saw him on the New York Stock Exchange two days ago. Huh? I don't believe that's true. With The Rock. Mm. You're a rock guy. The, the actor? You're a rock guy. I... <laughs> He's fine. So The Rock and Vince McMahon are close friends. Well, The Rock once worked for like I work for Dave Bortnoy, but all the shit he does, that's not got nothing yeah, to do with me. Yeah, but Stone Cold really like he was like fuck the man. Like I think Stone Cold, if anything, oh, but they were laughing. Yeah, original yeah. whistleblower. Oh, yeah, no, 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 hold on. He's on the this. right side of history. Oh, but they Stone were chumming it up the whole time. <laughs> they were chumming it up behind Stone the scenes. Stone Cold. Just How were they chumming it? He flipped his boss off <laughs> they were live counting, on television. He the brought scene. out a fucking. A uh, beer truck. They were counting their money. They were just, they were in lockstep. They were in cahoots. I think Stone Cold is just comes Great out on the game. right side of history. Brandon Walker and The Rock. Yep. Yeah. How's The Rock get and, blamed and in And Brock Lesnar, not so good. The Rock just got named uh, to the board of the parent company. Like, he's the one getting rid of this track. He is going to end up running the whole thing. No, Triple H runs the whole thing. Right, but I feel like The Rock is like. Even running the parent company? Yeah. All right, he might end up running the country. He could be a president one day. Is it weird that The Rock and his ex-wife are business, business partners, partners and best friends? Yeah, is that weird or no? No, because I think I, I think no. Okay. okay. Um. So <laughs> Vince McMahon, bad guy. If if the allegations are certainly bad, it it looks ugly. 
it, I did the mistake. I landed. They at, were using a woman as a sex toy. We landed at 2 a.m. last night, and I slept a little bit on the plane after Rough and Rowdy, so I was a little wired when I got home, and I read the whole report at yeah. 2 a.m., and I was like, that was not. That's, that wasn't good piece. Are there multiple reports? Because yeah, yeah, Ti- Titus had read something I hadn't read. That there's a there's actual sh- law, the shit on like, the head. Yeah, yeah. There's you like a court document of shitting on her head. Yeah, yeah. That's a lot. Yeah, that's a lot. That's where you draw the line. No, the line was way before that when they were using the woman as as a sex toy uh, and passing her around from and then using her as enticement to get wrestlers to sign. This is all alleged, obviously. So it's not good. And it's a good thing that wrestling has moved past Vince McMahon. He hasn't been involved for several years now. The craziest part, well, he has been involved. He literally just negotiated a deal for Netflix. Netflix, poor Netflix mm, had that like, wasn't right. two days. I don't to, think he, no, 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 no. He, I don't think he was part of that negotiation. I think Triple H and and, and Nick Khan did that. He's still involved. Aren't they doing uh, a Vince doc Netflix? Uh, I that's probably on hold now. Mm. It does feel. I saw the court document. Some of the texts are pretty horrific obviously he gets his day in court whatever but the timing is like i feel like they did the netflix deal and they're like okay now we're finally let's get yeah. vince mcmahon out of here bad guy yeah yeah maybe DJ. bad guy the royal rumbles tomorrow night oh yeah that's big right. weekend for wrestling Gonna and you're like cosplaying or role-playing as vince method vince. acting as a villain he is, is vince you've been getting your haters are evolving the Herculean levels. Yeah, that was uh, that's the first time I've ever, ever actually called the cops. You did? Yeah, I did. Why didn't you? Why don't you use our security guys? I've never been. A d- uh, all right. I, I was, when I, this I, happened I, four I years I ago, when I first got I know, here, I, know, I, I asked some people above me, and those people told me to go fuck myself. Oh, okay. I'm I'm telling you right now, okay. you should just talk to Mike. Okay. All right. Like, right. if there's ever an issue, okay. Mike handles that. Very good. Got it. And he is, yeah. like, very good at it. I've had a few things pop up that he... Okay, handles. very good. Yes. I'll talk to Mike. Mike will handle everything. I'll text him after this show. Yes, that's a good idea. Because he also wants to know. Yeah. Because he is our security. Yeah, no, it was just weird. Because I photoshopped it because the guy sent me pictures of my own house. So From the internet or for that he internet. took? From the internet. Oh, yeah, he's, yeah. Yeah, yeah, he's... I mean... He's fucking around, and, and I know, but it's still troubling. You probably wish the worst for him. I do. The thing is, I think... What could be worse than that? Than being that the guy? state that he's in right yeah. now. Yeah, it's it's rough. I, mm, it makes me mad. We should. Yeah, you're right. You're right. No, Let's talk. Yeah. We can handle it. That's but, uh, a private. He, he's thing. he's yeah. madder and he's yeah. miserabler. Yep. Yeah. Yep. All right. Fuck that guy. Let's do. Let's do the mystery. He does watch the yak. If y'all want to say fuck that guy real quick. Yeah, fuck, fuck that guy. Him. All right. I'll say this, uh, guy. We have an entire security team of uh, NYPD, CPD, and mm. yeah, they yep. they handle all this stuff. So s- cut the shit. Yep. Come out, dude. I think you're closeted. <laughs> I truly believe that. And, I, and I, I'm saying this as a, 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 a someone who's thankful for your support. I think you should come out. Because at the end of the day, he is watching. Yeah. That does count as a view. You know? <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. Uh, it's kind of a slippery slope. Right, dude. I'm going follow, to follow Kyle's lead and take the high road and say, I hope you get the help you need. Yes. I, mm-hmm. I hope you get the help. That you so obviously need. Yeah. yeah, I think every burner account you make to hate on Brandon is uh, a sperm cell, a gay sperm cell that you haven't let let out of your dick. <laughs> I think you need to just embrace who you are. Um, should we do the mystery box? Yeah, for sure. Now, there's one thing that I need to tell you about the mystery box. Uh oh, it's not a box at all. No, there is. There's there's one thing in there that triggers a wheel. Okay. Do you want to opt in? Is it like a deal? physical object or item that? No, tr- no it's a it's, it's like a, a like IOU that triggers a wheel. Okay. Do you want to opt in on the wheel? Always. It's Kyle is always down wheel. for the wheel. Always. Okay. Yeah. All right. So he's all opted right, in right. when he gets. All right. Should I uh, get a knife or something? You're a strong boy. I was hoping. What yeah, I was really next- hoping for your birthday, Kyle, was. Uh, my dream was we ordered that wrestling mat. I guess it takes a long time to get here. Oh, and thank you for that so much. Yeah, but if we had gotten the wrestling mat in time and just for Kyle's birthday, just let him just wrestle all of us yeah. for like an hour and a half. Yeah. I we can, just have to keep going awesome. back and forth. <laughs> all right, go slow. Out. Go slow. There's a lot of things in okay. there. Okay. Oh, my. Okay, you can pull it out. <laughs> okay. Sweet Mandy's cupcakes. These are gourmet. I've yeah. These. I've seen these. So good. On, on the... Social media, yeah, these are amazing. Yeah, Sweet Manny B's cupcakes. Shout out, Sweet. A Manny. hat. 
Oh. Oh, I forgot to say. I also bought I I can rock one of these. two items that I bought specifically because I think you'd look cute in it. Yeah, that's so I'm one. I'm kind of fetishizing Let's you. Let's see. Yeah. 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 A little bit of fetish fetishization. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay. I think down, maybe. I think down's better, but maybe up's better for the camera. Dude, I put bro glow. Don't rip face. a tag off anything you don't want. Oh, he definitely wants the bucket. I, think I want it. <laughs> oh. The string's on your nose. Oh, I love these. <laughs> there's a top to I that, get too. Them right now. Oh. Yeah, this oh, is a suit. There's, yeah, there's a track suit. suit. I got you a track suit. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Great. yeah. You're gonna look incredible. You want to put it, put it out in the middle so yeah, people yeah. can see. Yeah. I guess I I realized just now that I you are perpetrating with the Adidas hat and the Nike tracksuit. I know. I know. Does that well, I have does, Nike, does that bucket hat have a zipper? All over. What? It's a zipper. It does have a zipper. On it the has head. a pocket in it. Oh, uh, to the right. You gonna put it on right now? You go put it on. Go put it on, and then we'll keep change. going. Go change. Go change. Love. <laughs> He's gonna look so awesome when he comes back. Dude. Anything else I can put on in here? Uh, a bunch of stuff. You might have to do multiple put-on trips. Yeah, you might have to put. I won't leave. There's one thing that I. W I did buy a couple things that was like I think he'll look good in this, and I want, I want to see him in it. Is there anything dangerous in it? No. Oh, okay. It was actually pure friendship. The problem is Kyle is a hard guy to buy stuff for. I called yeah. Nick when I was at the store, and I was just like, "What is? What should I buy?" And he's like, "He doesn't like anything." When it comes to clothes, though, I feel like he could be easy because he does make everything look pretty cool. Nick said I should get him a cat, which I might mm. still do. We could probably pull that off within this show. Well, pause is coming on Tuesday because I'm giving him a big check. So I might have them bring a, a tabby bring cat, cat. Yeah. a little tabby kitten. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's a very... He'd love that. Sure. Yeah, yeah. He'd, he'd be excited. How was the yak yesterday? It was Mr. good. We, we had... It was, uh, it was a white... <laughs> White Sox Dave kind of stole the last fifteen minutes or twenty minutes uh, with his big shoes, uh, but it was it was good. Love it. We had a stray cat yak. It was uh, we had Rudy in, we had Donnie in, we had Dave in, uh, Danny, Danny Conrad. Conrad. So it was uh, it was a good time. Good. I did Barstool Radio yesterday for a little bit. Yeah, and and they argued you about the merits of working on Friday. Yeah, we had that argument. Huh? Did you check in on uh, Nate Fridays today? Uh, I wasn't able to because I was getting Kyle all his gifts, but I heard it's, I mean, I'm a big supporter of Nate. I watched the beginning and it was, uh, it was, it was a monologue. It was a, it was a heel promo. He cut a heel promo. Love that. First three minutes. And, uh, he, he was reading off teleprompter, but he was, I would describe it as it avant folks. guard for sure. Yeah. He was giving, I it like folks. that. I like that. Yeah. yeah. It was weird being back in the New York office. Um, just cause it was like, you know, so many memories there. So it was just weird. Mm-hmm. We, it was, I haven't uh, been back since we left. Yeah, it was. I mean, it was good seeing everyone. I still like everyone there. So, um, I like four of the thirty people there. Rough and Rowdy was good. You guys watch any of it? Yep. It was a good time. What was the most memorable moment from that? Um, I think it was when we confused. Uh, you had a mom slap. We had a mom slap, but then the best moment for me, there was two. Zod, did you hear Dave's line? I had to defend you. Oh God, he cooked me. No. Wow, he's my guy. We had the the uh, little people fight, and there was one of them <laughs> fell down and like twisted their knee, and I was like, "Oh no, an ACL!" And Dave was like, "I don't think they have any." Oh, <laughs> come on, Dave. Like, really? Like, what, oh, <laughs> really? <laughs> it was very like bang bang. <laughs> um, and then uh, no, there was a fight. Oh my God. Oh shit. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I was dressed. I really this am, motherfucker. I'm wow. mad about the perpetrating part. I really should have thought that through. Dude, it looks so great. Oh no, I clash. I don't think that's a problem. Okay. All right. All right. No you look swag. good. You look good. So swaggy. It's run yeah, DMC I with this. the I the, love yeah. tracksuit. There was like another that. moment where we had we they mixed up the fights. So we just like introduced the wrong guy and it was it coincided with the fastest knockout ever huh. in, in rough and rowdy history and the guy on uh, the, the guy we thought we were calling for had a note under it where he's like i don't like my nose i'm hoping to get hit in the nose so i can get a uh like a new nose new yeah. nose <laughs> and we were sitting there like this guy's nose is fine he knocks him out right away we're like holy shit like this guy's an incredible fighter the next fight a guy walks in and he had the biggest nose I've ever seen, and we're like, "There's the there's nose," the nose <laughs> and we just were like, "Nose," and just start, started calling him "Nose." So, 
That was very fun. Did he get hit in the nose? He didn't, but we talked to him after, and he was like, yeah, I really need a new nose. <laughs> is, somebody, is somebody buying the boy a new nose? I think he needs it. Yeah, he's going to get a new nose. <laughs> okay. All right. You want to, like, spread this out throughout the episode? No, go ahead. No, between? just keep going. Yeah. Let's keep right, going. It looks like that. a big box. I'll dress my boy. Okay, so what is that? Oh, yeah, this is just – this isn't even in your side, but it? size – I just I laughed when I saw uh, it. A field, yeah, I'm all for the fields. <laughs> <laughs> He's not even gonna be on the Bears. <laughs> hey, and it's also an XL. But I just saw the shirt and I was like, this is the most low effort shirt of all yeah. time. <laughs> that does not work at all. <laughs> uh, fields. fields. <laughs> <laughs> Who made that? What the fuck? Did we make that? <laughs> I know, right? Oh, it caught my, oh my eye. Oh, this is awesome. Okay. Those are Ooh. women yoga pants. Not, you know, you know. I want to see know. your ass in yeah. them. <laughs> it's ever growing. Yeah. Okay, so that's purely yeah, we're fetishization. Yeah, we'll I, I admitted that. that. I'll put them on for you. <laughs> yeah, you're up front with that. Yeah. Oh, my yeah. God, Dan. How big? There's a <laughs> lot of you, stuff man. in there. I yeah. really appreciate yes. it. Yes. It's your birthday. Oh, yeah. Um, Liz, I need one of these. I rock the, the plastic bottle. It's the Stanley mug. Oh, well, it's the Stanley. Yeah, it's the Stanley. Up, yeah. Yeah. Well, it's a, did you a, get me dose of those? It's a good thing that you need one of them because for the misses, <laughs> I got you. I think I got you three of them. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. These are the uh, cold, them up. cold yeah. punches for women. Right? Yeah, and I yeah. saw it and I was oh, like, yeah. well, yeah. yeah, we gotta get these. Ooh. Yeah, a little yeah. yellow. <laughs> so you got three. Oh, ma. You have three Stanley <laughs> mugs now. It's like Mentos. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Oh that. Oh it? that actually. That's for the basketball court, but you can get credit for it. I mean, huh. this? Oh, to, to knock yeah, the oh, traction yeah. mat. Traction yeah. mat? Yeah, for the yep. basketball court. So you will put feet. that on the basketball court when we play basketball this afternoon, but everyone should thank yeah, you. That's everyone. the Kyle yeah. Bauer yeah. traction everyone mat. Everyone should uh -huh. thank you. Cake for everyone. Yeah. Love it. That's good thinking right there, Dan. Yeah, it was. Oh, that's actually. Ooh, a little ankle action. Those are for me, but uh, you, okay. you don't have to give them to me. Yeah. No, we can share I had them. I, had, I <laughs> forgot I bought two things for myself. <laughs> 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 well, here you go, dude. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Appreciate Hell it. Hell yeah. Oh. oh, not the box. Not the orange box. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Well, when did you buy all this stuff? Today. Oh. Ooh, I love Air Maxes. Yep. I've been meaning to get a new pair. Yep. And they fucking match the fit. Figure that was Damn. the color you like. Colorway. Love this color. I love Kyle. No, I get it. No, no I get it. I love. No, what I'm trying to figure out is... This morning, you just Love. decided to buy this, and you got all this stuff? Yeah. Wow. I had to get a shopping cart. I don't know how you pulled that off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? Nope. Jesus. <laughs> Another one. Yeah. More. And yeah. I like this colorway, too. Yeah, they're Gore-Tex, so you can wear them, like, in the rain Fuck and stuff. yeah. Blueberry oatmeal. Oh, yeah. That's, yep. These are hot. Those are nice. Those look good, too. Good mystery box. Good. Yeah, I'm getting kind of. Sad. A lot of W's one in the mystery box. One of the best. <laughs> no. Hasn't been hard to, yet. Yeah, you said it's hard to buy for, but we haven't. Uh, also, this is all. We haven't triggered a week. Knocking it out of the oh. I'm knocking it out of the park. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Little Chicago Sky jersey. <laughs> <laughs> love this colorway though. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it's hot. Is that nice. a player? I love it. Who is, yeah, Cooper. Cooper. Yep. Oh, I don't know. Silhouette. I don't know who Cooper is, but. Hell yeah. Okay. Yeah. On too. <laughs> One more. Box is starting to get empty. Slightly empty, yeah. There's more stuff. Oh, okay. So this, I just what saw it, and I was like, I've here. always wanted to see a sliding glove in person. So I got you a sliding glove. <laughs> <laughs> what is a sliding glove? No, like, you're right. Baseball players wear it. Like I've, I've never seen them. I've never seen it. <laughs> wait, wait, what do they do with it? They wear it when they're like on first base and they're ready to steal oh, second. Just to, to not break their yeah. hand. Yeah. Aerodynamic. I just never seen one in real life, and I was like, this is cool. K KB yes. needs one if he ever needs to steal second. Uh, yeah, hey. We need a sliding area. And you get a couple extra inches on it too, so you can get the bag. Sure. I think it's the other hand. Yep. Look at that. Sliding glove, <laughs> right? Oh, yeah. yeah, that's great. I know. Had you guys ever seen one? Like, no, at yeah, a store? You, you, they're kind of ridiculous looking. I know, but I had to have it. This is crazy. If oh, it's a, oh, it's a pad on top for the tag and, yeah. and his feet. So then you're, yeah, then then when you slide into second, you won't break your fingers. Yeah, that's. I have to imagine <laughs> if you're 12 years old going to Little League with the sliding glove, yeah. you're getting bullied, right? 
I don't know. No, I think that's they think it's cool as fuck. That's cool now? Yeah, yeah accessories. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Accessories. You just dress like the MLB oh. players. That's the swag. It's yeah. like when we wore fighting necklaces yeah, well, thank when we were so 10. Much. Of course. Of we, course. Uh, let's course, not, let's not throw around weed. Oh, there's a piece of paper. <laughs> Didn't wear a fighting necklace no, when you were dude. Those were sick. The power balance wristbands? No, dude. Oh, you're trying to grab the piece of paper with your sliding glove? It's really been like that. My boy's got all types of fits. All right. Uh oh. All right. So this is uh, the last piece of it. What do we got here? <laughs> no. Destination wheel. Destination wheel. Ooh. Plane. Ooh. <laughs> uh, wow. Okay. <laughs> um. That sounds. Plane. You right. have expressed. Oh, come. You're doing too much. No, no. Well, well, you, don't know, you don't know. You don't know. You don't know. Yeah, You don't know. I'm ready to gamble. You don't know. You've expressed interest in going to a couple different destinations. Shit, I'll go to Burkina Faso if I have to. So I decided to put the destinations on a wheel, and you will get a flight to whichever no. place you, you land on. We'll do elimination style. Oh, my God. Um, they're not all great. I know. I, I hope they aren't. Yeah. There's a couple, though, that you got your eye on. Oh, God. Shit. Do you want to do the destination wheel, course, TJ? Of course. Okay. Anybody, so we've got. What do we get? Just real quick, anybody else want to call out when their birthday is? San Diego, Por Puerto Rico. Or San Diego, favorite city. Cairo, Cairo Illinois. Oh. Okay, Cairo, yeah, Illinois. Gary, Indiana. Prince yeah. Edward Island. Hawaii. Prince Edward Iran. Island. Yep. Give Big Iran. Cat $1,000. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> so we gotta figure out where you're gonna All go. Right. All right. <laughs> so it's elimination wheel. All these. <laughs> I'm rooting for you to get Prince Edward Island or Hawaii. I will go to Iran. Oh, there's a big one. Oh. I'm saving that for next year. That would really cuck uh, Rome if you went to Iran. Yeah. Is that? Iran? That's Dave and KB on the in the picture. Yeah. Oh. oh. Man, I'll still make a trip. Oh. Not to ask for too much, but would I be able to go uh, tomorrow? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, uh, oh, you can go tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Okay, this actually is, you got us some. You also might be giving him $1,000. Yeah, you could be giving me $1,000. I've been meaning to for a while. I don't want <laughs> oh, oh, that's I the really one I really do want to go to one of those provinces. Oh. But I'll, hey, there's always time. You definitely could go to Gary, Indiana tomorrow. Hawaii and San yeah. Diego being left. This, yeah, is, that's this pretty, is a great Final Four right that's now. pretty good. Oh, 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 stop, oh big, big, stop, big here. Stop. Oh, okay, oh wow. Off. Hey. Oh, you're going somewhere. <laughs> wow. I don't think we've ever had Hawaii, San Diego, and Gary, Indiana on the same wheel. <laughs> oh, my God. Top three tour destinations. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Now, I'll go to Gary, maybe not tomorrow, but next week. Oh, oh, hey! Oh, you're going somewhere nice. Not too much. Wow. All right, so best of seven. Dude, these are my two favorite American destinies. So whatever hits four times. This is a Have you ever been to either? Inside. Kyle? What? Have you ever been to either? I've been to San Diego, but not for long enough to, like, truly enjoy it. All right, San Diego is one. On the bucket list. I know I would love it. San Diego. San Diego has two. If it's a sweep, you do have to piss yourself, but that's... On the flight. Yeah, that should be fine. <laughs> Ooh. Oh! Oh, we got a series. Hi. Ooh, 3-1 San Three one. Diego. And that's oh, San Diego. There we go. All right. Beautiful. All right. Okay, so KB, you just yes, let me I was know. I'm going to go to Hawaii anyway. I am going to Hawaii anyway. Oh you my let God. me know when you want to go to San Diego. You can obviously, it's a plus one, too. So you can two two air tickets to San Diego. Just let me know. Wow. Yeah, happy, maybe, birthday. Uh, happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Liam Blutman instead of my girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so, so awesome, but also me. <laughs> Hey, you gotta understand. Happy birthday! Thank you so much. I, I that was the best birthday 
oh. crop of presents I've ever gotten. Okay. No disrespect. For my no. mother. And Brandon's going to be like, well, my birthday's coming up. I just wanted to be very clear. This is not for everyone's birthday. Kyle was a little yeah, down. There's a lot of, di- <laughs> I, I, lot of birthdays. I don't think Kyle <laughs> uses mental health as a, a crutch. So mm-hmm. when he is down, he's actually down. So I was like, I got to get him something real. Dude, thank mm-hmm. you so much. Yes, of course. You're going to look good in those shoes and the yoga pants. And the full ass suit he's got on now. It looks great. Do you want me to do a destination wheel for your no. birthday? No. We could. I mean, of course, yes, but no. It's not a... <laughs> what if it was just all bad destinations? There's no bad destinations. There's just bad people that go places. Whoa. Oh, shit. That was deep. You ever think about that? Maybe... maybe the... uh, I could think of a bad destination yeah. for maybe you. Maybe the missing piece in that destination is yeah, you. Yeah, I could think of a bad destination for you. Where? We could do like a... 12 hour trip to Oxford you have to go to the game beautiful place they got good restaurants the good Grove. restaurants it's only an hour and a half away from uh, no no you'd have to stay nice place Ajax is a good restaurant they got some good restaurants there so wait what would happen cool. if you went there would there be like a crowd of people like coming at you or there I'd be a lot of people a shit? lot of people yelling at me and hating at me and a lot of people like uh, but all in good fun or they're, they're I think like, it'd all be in good real. fun I don't think it would be I, I, I don't think it'd be like physical or nothing how many egg bowls have you been to Four or five. Were they? Did you go to one in Oxford? Uh, yeah, no, no, that, that's what I meant. Four or five in Oxford. Oh, yeah. Shit. Yeah, I've gotten yelled at, barked at, <laughs> at but that was before. Barked at. barked at. Yeah, before anybody. Like knew. by dogs or people? People mock okay. barking after after they beat us and there was barking. Oh, because you Why guys are the bulldogs. bulldogs yeah. Oh, that makes sense. What's your record on the road? I've never won one there. Wow. Uh, Have yeah. you won one at home? Oh uh, yeah, I've. I've Probably like five or six at home. That's fun. Yeah. Yep. San Diego. Where would be, where in the developed world would you say is your nightmare destination? Because I feel like you would be comfortable just about anywhere, Brandon. I'd be comfortable. I don't know where we could send you. I'd be comfortable anywhere. I'd be outside fine. of, obviously, I mean, I'd, I'd, Middle East type countries or whatever. Um, I do fine anywhere. I was fine in New York. I'm fine in Chicago, Iowa City. I'm fine in rural places. Ooh, Iowa City. I'd be fine there. As long Iowa as, City's beautiful. As long as there's not like a group of people that are, yeah, I might not do well in Iowa City. Tropical Island? Uh, yeah, maybe. I would do fine. Bora Bora. Brandon Walker beautiful. and Bora Isn't Bora. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Isn't that the you, clear water? Mm-hmm. Oh, probably just somewhere. chill out enough? Somewhere or? that's hot for no reason. Yeah. yeah if I yeah. send you to the Sahara? Yeah, that, yeah. Would, that would be troubling. That would and be I had troubling. to be outside? Yeah. If it... If I had to be outside on this trip, that would suck. I sent you to the Sahara without a hat. Uh, if you sent me like on a walking tour of the Sahara, yeah, I'd that just would kill you. That would be so bad. Yeah. Uh, do they offer walking tours of the Sahara? <laughs> Probably I'm not. sure. Yeah, I'm sure we could. We could they get have like ultra up. marathons there. Yeah, we could get that hooked up. No problem. In the desert. That yeah. Punishing. Uh huh. Some dude yeah. got stranded in there for days. Had to eat bat blood. Oh yeah, he was like pissing. It's insane. Like yeah. he was pissing blood, and he was. Everyone was like, "Dude, you should probably get that check." He's like, "I'm fine." I oh, know that's he survived, and I think he's doing well. Oh look at this! At what cost? Oh my god, forty four dollars. So cheap. <laughs> <laughs> you on a camel would be very funny. I can see it. I don't know that I'd do well on a camel. I don't think you would either. Camel one hump or two? Are there are there two hump camels? Yeah, there are. There's one hump camels and two hump camels. Don't you sit in the middle of the humps? There's definitely one I've hump ever, camels too, right? There's two humps. Yeah, no. I think Chase all two right. humps. Got me fucked up. No, I read a one hump camel. Oh, once. they oh, are two. Crazy. Oh, so they really are like they have naturally saddle. for seats. They have yeah. a built-in. You can ride camels at the Philly Zoo. Really? Yeah, I did it when I was 14. Damn. It hurt. A camel just looks pissed off at all times. Did Joe Camel have a hump? He was the best. He did. He did some humping. What? Didn't? Wasn't he cool as fuck? And he always had bitches. Oh yeah, he did. Yeah. Joe Camo. Oh, he oh was cool yeah, as so fuck. cool. Joe Camo. Oh. Yeah. All the cigarette guys were cool about Marlboro look, man. It doesn't look like he has a hump though. Yeah, it's in there somewhere. No, I don't think so. No. That's definitely no hump. Well, that's not a anatomically correct camel. It is very funny that they were like, "Yeah, let's make a comic." Cartoon smoker. Cartoon, yeah. Mm-hmm. To get the kids. 
Now they're coming after our Zins. It's fucking bullshit. Wow. Might make me political. Yeah, that'll get you into it. This is a bridge too far, the Zen. Yeah. Do you, ever, do you ever have an Zen. era where you like were pretty passionate? No, not really. Mark? In politics? Yeah. No, no. I had a... I, yeah, I don't... When I was talking on PMT last week about uh, college, and I had a really good GPA, and I was like saying it was all tricks. I forgot, because I went up to Madison with some of my buddies for that game last week. They reminded me that uh, we took a class one year that was called C-Fact, I think, and the only thing we had to do in the class is just deny that global warming was real. <laughs> And we had to like say that nuclear energy was the way. Oh, that'd be easy. And that was it. Like we didn't have to. We got like five credits for just like we we had to like watch a couple of movies on a Monday night, and then like had to stand at like a fair and like pass out pamphlets, being like nuclear energy is the way, climate change isn't real. But this was in the the, the aughts. Yeah, this is like oh four oh five yeah. early aughts. Cool back then. Yeah, but I was fighting the good fight for nuclear yeah. energy. <laughs> um. Can y'all explain the Stanley Cup phenomenon to me? I no. cannot. No, I, I have no because idea. Because there are other cups and yeah. things like that. Right. But this one is the, the rage. Yeah. Why? The tumblers have been around for a while. They've been trendy for a little bit. I guess this is a... Uh, they're bigger? It, it or? really bothers me that it's the Stanley Cup. To they're yeah. Every, right. every time yeah. I see it, it bothers me. Yeah, I saw a graph. This this company's been around for like eighty years. It's like a hardware company or something. Yeah, and tools. They've, yeah, and they've they like tools and yeah. shit. I don't know. Some hot chick on social media probably had one, and that's all it takes. When you, look, when you Google yeah, Stanley Cup, it shows culture. up before the hockey. Oh my god! Can you do before Stanley Cup, Cup uh, revenue or something? Because it was like they were just like kind of a not a mom and pop, but <laughs> seventy-five million a year to seven fifty. Fifty. Well, that's what insane. Is Crazy range. 10x. Yeah, they were just kind of chugging along for the last 80 years. Yeah, they are 10x. Also, Yetis are just better. W what happened though? Was it like a TikTok? Was it an influencer? Yeah, it's like they're they're big and they fit in a cup holder. So like, girls on online started collecting them or whatever. There's a bunch of colors and you can accessorize them. And then like, there's limited ones that like the Starbucks one. People were lining up outside Starbucks or at Target for like. <sighs> Six hours to wait for a release. <laughs> what was that noise, Mark? None of these things are unique to the Stanley Cup. Yeah. It's Correct. kind of like Pokemon these are cards. These are all, everything you just said, Yeti Tumblr, or name another brand that makes tumblers. This but apply it is, to all of them. It is the, the best, like some, best trophy in sport. Yeah, but it, it, it might be the name. It really yeah. might be the name. I have a Stanley Cup. Well, do you want to like cool to say? Yeah, <laughs> here, take one. And you can like yeah. smash it with the hydraulic press. I'll I also Bro. never hate on people oh. who like wait out for that because I did wait out for like an Xbox 360. Oh, yeah, I waited for way that. long ago. Yeah, I waited for NCAA 05. Yeah, there was a oh, line for oh, Xbox 360 camping out. Isn't the guy that runs TMZ? They had their like TV show. Wasn't he like drinking one of the out of one of these? Oh, that was. Like 20 yeah, years Harvey ago. Levin. Harvey Levin. Harvey Levin. He used to always have a large cup. He used yeah. to always have one of these. Is that who started it? That's a really big cup. There's also like the, the video <laughs> of a car that like was fully engulfed in flames and like exploded. And then they went to like the wreckage and there was just like a Stanley Cup with like liquid still in it. It's still in the car. Like it survived like a car exploding. I feel like that should be a negative, not a positive. Brandon, I know you're going to disagree. It's indestructible. Yeah, but it also like what. What is what's the material that you're drinking your water out of that makes it indestructible? Why not make the whole car out of the Wait, Stanley this Cup? Is, yeah. This is indestructible. It like it survived like a massive car fire and there was still liquid. But in the could car. I like run over it with a Winnebago? No, no it probably crush. It'd crush. Right. Well, there's only one way to find out. Can you see if there's any videos of people trying to run over? Trying Stanley to crush them? Sure. You look cool. Forty ounces is too much. You look cool. Forty ounces of a drink in one. City. Especially for like what? Especially for women who, let's be honest, they, long. every woman ever drinks like two o two ounces of their coffee. Right. You should only put water in this. Yeah. Anything else up above thirty ounces is this is crazy. This is too bad. big. What about Mountain Dew? <laughs> that's that's the coal mine. Elkana Baja Rock. Blast. Yeah. Elkana Rock. Is a Stanley Cup full of Mountain Dew? Yeah. A lot of peeing. By the way, Brandon, I forgot to say, no spoilers, but congratulations on the perfect game. First time in dozen history. Thank you. It was the, the first only time one in dozen history. It was the first time in dozen history. The, the only one in dozen history. 
I, I need you to let me finish my sentence. It was the first time in dozen history we were the very first. So how long did your record stand? Well, that record can't really be broken. That's a, You can only tie that well, What did you say you did? We were the first team in dozen history to have a perfect go, get all of our questions and the bonus round. It was mm-hmm. the first time it ever happened. Oh, and it's never happened. So it's the highest scoring game ever? Th- that no, it's it 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 was not the highest scoring game. Oh, ever. who has the highest scoring game ever? Well, that record was also broken recently. Oh, mm-hmm. so then your record doesn't really matter. I never said it did. You you brought it up. It's who Kyle, got the who got the uh, the uh, the Frankettes? What did you guys get? Wow, get all your questions. Yeah, I guess we did. Yeah, they ended up with twenty one. I think. Say your piece though. We probably, I don't have a we piece. Got some cupcakes. I said nothing. I've said nothing. It was very apparent. When Jeff D'Lo was just tweeting constantly about your record that something was up. Yeah. Well, I don't know how Jeff decides these things, but I'm pretty sure they recorded their match two days before we recorded our match. Oh, so actually you so he, didn't have the first right. record. Right. So he flipped. I think he – Oh, so they – He fucked it. He so set us Frank up to – technically was the first to ever – Right. He set us up to fuck us. So you have no record. Right. He set us up to fuck uh, us. He, uh, oh, you wow. just beat it? He let us have the record. Oh, you just did it too? Yeah. yeah, well, you we guys just did, did it better. It. Oh, <laughs> but <laughs> I, I think well, you guys recorded before us, so it could have just been you guys. But he, he let ours go first, so we could have he could tweet about it, and then y'all could break it. Jeff wouldn't do that, would he? Like, oh, full yeah. string. I just saw so the, many tweets uh, about Brandon, Dave, and uh, Kurt gave him permission yeah. to. He would. The experts right. having a perfect game, and I was like, something's up. This feels like a lot of tweets. And then I, in the green room last night, Frank was like, "Did you see?" Uh, Brandon's perfect uh, game, and I was like, "Yep." He's like, "Well, I broke it." Like, I broke it. That's what he said. I broke it. Yeah, I think he said I. Oh, that's that's interesting. I mean, it is Frank and the Frank Cat. It's, it's just interesting that he said I. I would never say I on the experts. You I never say, would. I say we. You never. I would would. Never say it's my show. I say it's our show. You never would. That that dozen drama was twenty four hours of just dominating the company, and then just it's just over. And then yeah, when the when the dust settled, I was the only one that really got fucked. Yeah, and mm-hmm. everybody else got. Which what I'm they fine wanted. with that. Yeah, everybody got what they wanted, and then some. And I was left with uh, Mincy, with Mincy and Ken Jack bitching at each other, and I'm stuck in the middle, just wondering how I got here. <laughs> Triv League would have rocked. It would have, yeah. Dave and I were were some of the ideas we had thrown around. We were going to do a tournament on a yacht. Oh my god. Well, yeah, y'all could fund idea. that for the dozen. I also, I also had the idea, um, similar to how the NFL plays games in like Europe and Mexico, we just do a week where every single team has to be has to eat an eighth of mushrooms before they're. It's incredible. These are all great ideas. Yeah. And instead, substance week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just every game is just under a different substance. That's awesome. We do the I've, Coke, I've actually the Coke played, one is like a twenty-minute game. I played that against RA before. Yeah, that's true. He's yeah, yeah. a lot of people week. did. Yeah. <laughs> Substance week would have rocked. That should be a thing. Is yeah. anyone else doing that? I don't know. But like I... the... Can you do that on YouTube? Can you, you just can't show that you doing the drugs. You can hint at it. Oh, you can, you can say imply you did, that you did stream. drugs, but you can't physically do them on camera. I've had the idea that we're, I think we're going to do it at some point uh, where Hank, PFT, and I do a scramble, three-man scramble against Jake. We eat and ate the mushrooms, and Jake is dressed up like Toad. <laughs> I think that would be very good. <laughs> That'd be a great video. Yeah. <laughs> Just playing playing golf high on shrooms against Toad. <laughs> oh, I, I, I like that there's no reason for him to be dressed up as Toad. Well, he's not going to do the drugs, so yeah. we have to figure out. I was going to say, we could do like a random person on this show gets dosed, but we did that once, and it ended in disaster. Wait, when was that? When we did Monster Rip. You, you, yeah, and yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yes. right. Yeah. <laughs> yes, TJ puked. You were out for like a day and a half. Right? I was asleep in one of the conference rooms for nine hours before the Brandon Walker College Football Show. Your face was ghost white. Yeah, I saw, uh, I saw demons. <laughs> I retired from weed because of that. You retired from weed? Yeah, and I retired from milk because of the milk chug challenge. Retired from milk. How do you, you retire did, from? Wait, milk? it was one hit of weed. It was like it was a bong three rip. fourths of a bonger. Oh, I was a bong. I don't know why my weed tolerance is drastically lower than everything else. Well, you don't smoke. I used to do, like, the vape pen at night. Yeah, but that yes. was a fad for a while. All right, what else we got going on? Um, I'll text it to you. Hold on. What? He'll text it to you. Hold on. Hmm. 
on Barstool Radio yesterday, it was funny because I, I, I did, Dave was giving us credit for our shows and he was like, they plan everything out and I had to like mm-hmm. clear it up. Like the yak is literally never planned. Um, and John Rich did nail it. He's like, the, the yak is just, the show is making plans. <laughs> yeah. That's true. A large, br- <laughs> every <laughs> episode, <laughs> healthy plans. Yeah. Yeah. You just, just plan. make plans it's for things really we'll never do. A planning meeting. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> every day it's at an noon. extended planning meeting. <laughs> That's why our yeah. female audience is growing so much. It probably. <laughs> well, they They're love, addicted they to plans. us. <laughs> yeah. You're in plans. The, the responsible planning. guys that plan. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of which, the the Royal Rumble case race. Yes. Is this actually happening? Do we think now yes. that we've had a few days to like? Yes. One hundred percent. Think happening. on it. It's going to be it so hard to, to pull I mean, it off. We, we, it's. In. I I think it, it, people won't want to hear this because um, I know that they want the grandiose one, but I really do think we should try to do it with our people first. And then it will build off that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like you got to show, you got a proof of concept, and then other true. people will be like, "I that looked like so much fun." And when I say our people, it could still be like Mangold, like could be Shane, could be the the Bus and Boys, but like to get a ton of extra outside people, we have to like show oh, how no, much fun it, it gets is. Gets a lot of views. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So we will do it though. I was thinking yeah. that I was going through my Rolodex of the numerous celebrities that I know. And I was like, how do you even explain what this would be to them? Right, but if you can show them, be like, look, Mm -hmm. we dress up as wrestlers, got like 500,000 views, it was awesome. Yep. So I think that will be the plan. So Jane Lynch will not be the first one. Yeah, right. Levels up. (laughs) Jane Lynch. Jane Lynch. Jane Lynch. Oh. Well, she's not, I mean, uh, we have proof of concept. We'll try to Mm -hmm. get her. Give it to her people and see what happens. The second one or third one, maybe. That would be funny if you did like a, if we, if you just use your Rolodex and got like only big J journalists. <laughs> oh. Or just only lesbians. That's it. It's like that's what John Rothstein's music. Right uh-huh. <laughs> oh my God, is that Nicole Arbach? <laughs> <Yeah>. Taylor Lorenz. <laughs> <laughs> Here she comes. Stu Mandel. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Just get blackmail on all of them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we should do it. Wait, TJ, you texted me something? Oh. Mm. Oh. Wasn't even in the group. It was just solo, huh? Yeah. Um, oh, shit. I think we can show that. Yeah, show it. Someone made a yak beer. Wow. A brewery in Illinois so. made a wheel is just be- uh, brew. That's fucking sick. What does it taste like? I think it's like a mixture of a, a number of other like hop variations or something that they do. So it's kind of awesome. like spinning a wheel. Shout out them. White Oak Brewing. That's they reached sick. out. They want to give us some. Yeah. Shout out to White Oak. Where are they out of? Uh, Somewhere Let's in see. Illinois. Followed by Nick. Did Nick oh. brew this beer? And yeah, on there, on the Untapped, which is like a beer social media, read the uh, description. And Wheel is just features Solero, Nelson, Sovin, El Dorado hops. When decisions of great importance must be made, you have to trust the wheel. Weekdays at noon central on YouTube. TJ, your dad is a loser. Huh. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, he's the IPA guy. Yeah, no, he's he, this oh, beer was made for it. him. Yeah, and now I like that. Every day. I like that. That's a great job. Great job by them. Shout out White Oak. <laughs> TJ, your dad is a loser. Um, by the way, next week we're going to have the end of uh, Chick January. Morrow's coming back yep. yes. on Wednesday. Very excited. He's got something that. up his sleeve, too. You think so? I guarantee it. Guy yeah. like him. Guy like him? Do. Do, what are you What's What are you in your – I'm reading the prep sheet right now. Steven, what are, you, are you like thinking fitness these days? Well, yesterday was swingers. Uh, and you shit on that, and that turned into a great conversation topic. I never shit on it. I am the one that read it and said it. You never said, shit on it. Does anybody know any swingers, really? <laughs> Bang. White Sox saved 15 minutes. <laughs> of course he does. Right, but that's – I could have said any word, and I would have got 15 minutes out of White Sox Dave. Fair, but it's a good story. I feel like there's a couple that probably fetishize, fetishizes White Sox Dave. Like, as their third. Fuck, I hope not. No, I guarantee it. He's White Sox s- Dave talked about he knows a swinger, yeah. like a good friend of his. 
is looking good. <laughs> so are you getting into shape? It's pull ups yeah, and pull planking. A up, hundred pull ups in five minutes from the whole show. I do not think we could do that. I don't think we do it either. Well, I can't give you one. You could give us one. No. You could do one pull up. Kyle, how many pull ups? You forty or fifty? Yeah, it's it's just can Kyle do a hundred pull ups. <laughs> right, right, five minutes. Fifty maybe. Oh. Hey, so you can do a couple, no? I could do five. I could do a couple, but like, what, when we're getting to a hundred, what's that? I mean, me, Nick, and Mook ain't giving you no pull ups. Yeah. I could give you ten, and you. I think I think we could actually. I don't know if I. I think the strategy is Kyle goes, yeah. and then when Kyle needs a break, one of us does two. It's like you right. Kyle jump right back <laughs> in. Yeah, like that's not like. <laughs> yeah, I could. I could just all Kyle. Kyle's I could do, do five even. sets of two. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, maybe we could. Steven, have you said anything about the fact that you've lost so, people so much money this year? He keeps losing. I don't know if you guys The saw data still not come season. come around? Losing. Double loser last night. Double loser last night. How many units are you down since January 1st? Uh, between 17 and 18. Whoa, Whoa. my God. Whoa. It's just January 24th, isn't it? In what, NBA. In, in what were your league. losers last night? Uh, Drew Holiday over 10.5 combined rebounds and assists. He finished with 10. And Bam Adebayo over... 35 and a half combined points, rebounds, and assists. The and he was tweeting at the NBA account trying to get stats. <laughs> you love when I do that. That's my favorite thing. It's good when you and win, it works but when you lose, it's it looks pathetic. Yeah. Whatever. I The one I tweeted last, that absolutely, they were incorrect on in that, that. I stand by that. Have you ever talked? Have you talked? Can we watch that? What do you, let me see the thing that you tweeted him. The, the rebound steal I tweeted? Yeah. Uh, I think we can play that, right? What uh? NBA Do you have you ever talked to this guy? Who? The NBA stats guy? Uh, no, but I messaged with someone that used to work there. All right, so this is alley oop, which wasn't converted by Chris Stops, was ruled as a steal for Bam. Perzingis makes a follow through motion and taps to the rim. That's a steal. I think that's a steal, yeah, that's Steven. How was that a steal? Because he stole he the pass. A shot. He yeah, he stole the it. Pass was that deflected. wasn't a shot. It was Poor a rebound. steal. Porzingis deflects it. It goes off the rim. No, but Bam deflects it. That's the steal. Watch Porzingis' wrist. Bam. Follow through motion. Well, that's him trying to catch it. It's not him trying to catch the ball. That's a steal. And as soon as you got to start a that's a textbook steal. Porzingis' wrist. It's a wrap. I'm glad they they <laughs> stuck to their guns on that one. Whatever. This one wasn't close, but it was early, so I mean, it could have mattered. First quarter, midway through the first quarter. Fight if you bet with me, I fight for you. You fight for you. I thought you were a sharp. No. Yeah, it's it's, it's taking a horrible a, tumble. Just a magnetic zero. <laughs> no, he is. <laughs> <laughs> Steven is not a sharp. Every month I've been between fifty five and sixty five percent since I've been doing this and this month has been uh what is this month horrific? At? Uh I don't know off the top of my head, it's been horrible. I mean it was six and seventeen at one point, and I think oh. maybe like eight and oh. twenty. So oh. like roughly. Oh yeah, terrible. Is it affecting your day-to-day -day mental health? I'm um, definitely a lot sadder, and you know. So, so yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's a big <laughs> yeah. it's, nah, nah, you're just a lot sadder. <laughs> <laughs> he just realized what that means. <laughs> I don't know he how you define no, mental health. Yeah. But I have this pit in my stomach yeah, at all times. Yeah. I don't want to get out of bed in the morning if that makes I cry me, a lot. Yeah, if that's mental health, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a lot sadder. But that's the thing. It's like I I get down and then it's like all right, work yourself out of it. Just yeah, get <laughs> into get into the next day's line. It triggers your fight response. Go go to bed and I feel I put out a pick last night at like 1:30 in the morning. I feel good about it. Oh, you're chasing. You always do props, right? I do props. Yeah. Have you thought about strain from that and just doing like no. Celtics money line? Uh, it's to get back. I, I, I've done that like once or twice. So then it just kind of. But you're in a slump right now, and you are. You got to see the ball go through the basket. You know, like get an easy one, get to the free throw line, hit a couple. What you don't understand, Mark, is he would then have to root for uh, like a team versus a team in a team sport, and one team to win. Oh, you can't do that. Yeah, it's that's, so anti that's, what sports are about. Yeah, that's that's I very like, I like my complicated. Lane. I went to a. Uh, uh, Nick, I took Stephen, Nick, and. Uh, Jenks to a Knicks playoff game last year. Oh yeah, and Steven's a big Knicks fan, and Steven he was just years. locked in on who was it, Donovan, Donovan Mitchell? Mitchell, and getting his rebounds or something. I was just like, what is going on right now? But that was that was an instance where I tweeted that at NBA Stats. We got the video. It got reversed, and we won by one. But your team was in the playoffs. I mean, we won by like 
20 points. I know, but, yeah. but it was like – My fourth quarter was ruined. It's the most pure thing of, yeah. like, watching your team in the playoffs. I saw – I was watching the uh, Heat Celtics last night, and Jalen Brown had a steal and an uncontested dunk, and he's, like, doing a chin-up, and they're doing the slow-mo replay. And behind the backboard is this 12-year-old kid wearing a Heat jersey that's jumping up as he's dunking it. Yeah. And uh, I was like, that's, that's fucked up that this kid is – cheering for a Celtics better. dunk yeah. and then I thought he might have Jalen Brown yeah. like over <laughs> over 28 points or something <laughs> yeah he's, he's probably Keishon Boutte yeah. oh my god his that was funny as hell 3,900 plays and he was a good gambler no 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 89 right? or 8,900 89. plays yeah. yeah he won he won 500 grand but then lost it all but he only lost like 50 he, so he, that's considered a good gamble. Oh yeah, you lose uh, fifty grand. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He he had <laughs> over eighty nine hundred plays. Yeah, eighty nine hundred plays. He had seventeen plays on college football. So he was betting on himself to hit over. Betting on everything, and losing. Yeah. <laughs> but if you told me I could do eighty nine hundred plays and I would only lose fifty grand, I'd be like, that's Probably the greatest run of my life. That is your life. Yeah. That's the greatest run of my gambling life. Eighty nine hundred plays. How many picks did you have this year in Pick'em? And you were like right there. That's 20. Uh, I had like I did 450 the plays in Pick'em. Huh. So he lost. Did he little, bet on his like He bet on his own games? He bet on yeah. his over. Yes. He bet on himself uh, to score a touchdown. Over. He bet on himself he to. Didn't hit it. Yeah. <sighs> Against Florida State, he bet himself to score a touchdown. He bet himself to go over his passing or his receptions, and he didn't either. Wait, did he get arrested? Yes. Holy shit. Yeah, so what's going to happen to him? You can't bet on your own games. Yeah, what's the. Cr- That's. Betting on yourself he to score a touchdown. Age. I think that was the other yeah, that part. should yeah. be. If you bet on yourself in a positive way, that don't that's a lot different than betting on yourself in a negative way. That's what Pete Rose did, though. That's the Pete right. Rose thing, yeah. but then you got to think about like the the butterfly effect. Yeah. yeah. Like if he bets on himself one day, and then he like burns his whole bowl. Pack. Right. Because he's like, we got to win this game. Right. So and then the, the next game they suck. But that's that's a coach. That's not an individual player. Like, yeah. I think to, to score a touchdown. No, because it's still, it's still muddy because he has access to the game plan. So if he's in the red zone package, he could just be like, I need the ball down here. And he should say that lying. anyway. Well, yeah, that's true. He will want the ball anyway. Right. I'm like, he's going to always want to score a touchdown. I it's think like, it'd be like mindset. saying, like, Chris Jones gets a million dollars if the Chiefs win on Sunday. But no, 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 because what it, the butterfly effect is, it's uh, first and goal from the 12, and the play's not going to him. Does he block his heart on that play? Oh. He thinks if we can get it down to the three-yard line, that's 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 point. Point. then maybe I'll get the ball the next play. Yeah, Chris Jones yeah. gets a million bucks if he wins on Sunday, so, like, I, I think he's going to be motivated to win. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's going to want to try to go to the Super Bowl. That's going to change his approach. (laughs) Yeah, yeah. Feels like he's going to try really hard in this game. Who's Chris Jones' agent? Because it feels like he's got a different uh, million dollar bonus to hit every single time he plays. He's uh, he's got those. uh, I think they're the Cats brothers. Oh, I don't really mean who's his agent. I just he it does seem like he's playing for a million dollars every single week. Yeah, he's got very incentivized deal. Shout out Houston, Mississippi. That's where he's from. Yeah, Kyle knew that. Mm-hmm. Where do you play college ball? Ole Miss, Mississippi State. Oh, I remember as an Ole Miss guy. Well, he he wasn't. Is he really good in college? Yeah, he was very good. He was on the number team. What number one? Oh yeah, he was our best defensive player when went back. I've watched every college football playoff game. I do not remember that team. Okay, well I didn't say they made the college football playoff. Oh, that was okay. That was a misconception there. I said they went to number one. Oh, okay. It is a very funny thing that. Brandon has to hold on to that the first ever college football playoff mm-hmm. poll, Mississippi State was number one. And I will hold on to that That's motherfucker till the day. Literally I all know. downhill from there. Oh, y'all don't know how good that season was, though. Fuck, that was awesome. I do. <laughs> yeah, but y'all, I, I know y'all didn't get good till late. Like I, 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 would, I would argue that the, season was pretty national, fucking fun. I would argue that being good and being number one in October was better than being number one after the national championship. I would love to hear you argue that. Go. Um, I liked it more. <laughs> <laughs> But your Buckeyes won. Well, I wasn't a Buckeye yet. <laughs> I didn't become a Buckeye till later. <laughs> you didn't matriculate till no, later. No, no, much later. <laughs> Buckeye Brand is my favorite nickname. Is he? Is Dave still texted you Michigan every day? Every day. Every single day. Uh, it was weird because it was late yesterday. It was like nine o'clock, but it was very early this morning. Probably the still doing it after ever. Harbaugh left. Yeah, I I uh, I texted him about Harbaugh leaving the other day, and he just replied, "Michigan." <laughs> yeah, this morning was eight twenty four a.m. Michigan, Michigan. Hmm. You Ooh. know, you know that 
this is setting up for you to just troll him back when Michigan loses. Oh, I know. You can just tweet Michigan back at him. It's a long play. Okay, all right. It's just, a long play. Just making sure you see that. Yeah. Okay. You got this. I'm I'm fine. It's just me against Dave. Fuck Can't me. win again, can they? Obviously, no. They're going to be – no. The Celtics are winning the, the championship, though, so be prepared for that. Is that true? Yeah, they're going to win the, the NBA. It does look like it. Yeah. I mean, they're they're pretty good, but I they're not slam dunk. I mean, they've else. been the best team in basketball in the regular season. It feels That's like true. five years now. This team does feel dip, but Porzingis will get hurt. Porzingis get hurt. got hurt last night. Yeah, he rolled his ankle last night. It, it was it on was it on that play? It was not. He was on fire though. I think he had like sixteen points in the first quarter. Oh, and they kept letting him play. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you want to do the high noon ad read? Someone? Not Nathan I'll do Brandon? it. Sip on oh, summer. Oh, you can't go anywhere. You, it, on Kyle's birthday? You made a deal. <laughs> you made a deal with Kyle. No, it's his like birthday. You made a deal with Kyle. Uh, it's going to be tough. I, I eat right before the yak, and then and I turn certain foods to pee. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> It's a classic problem when those foods turn to pee. Sip on summer flavors in the middle of winter, and introducing the all new, all new high noon Snowbird Pack, featuring the perfect mix of winter and summer flavors. The eight pack includes two new flavors, raspberry and plum, alongside high noon classics peach and lemon, all made with real vodka and real juice. The Snowbird Pack is a winter exclusive, so get it before the ice melts. Track down the pack nearest you at highnoonspirits.com. dot com. dot com. Did you guys see this parking um, spot outside? Yeah. Who is it? Oh, you don't know who it is? I'm not going to reveal the name. Let you me see the parking it's spot it. and I'll guess. It's. Oh, my God. You know who that is, don't you? I don't have a problem with it. It's also the last parking yeah, spot. Yeah, it's the last that parking spot. I don't, I don't have a problem with it. It is the last parking spot. But that's a sidewalk. Yeah, but you're, you, they're not on the sidewalk. Oh, is that Jack McCarthy? That's Jack cars? McCarthy, yeah. Jack. What a douche. Also, real quick. He told me, Jack said he parked that far away because Steven was still in his car and he wanted to leave him room to get out. So he was trying to help you, Steven, is what he is his story. It is true that I was in my car on the phone at the time of his parking. <laughs> so it sounds Wait, like he was what? doing you a favor and then you, right. you, you shit that? on him? I, I asked him. First off, it was okay if I tweeted it out. I blurted all the stuff. But, but he, no, it's a hilarious. It's hell, it's so far. He did that for on. you. He did no, that, that, that for that, you that, a that, favor. That's, that's, what he's, that's what he's saying. He left me eight feet <laughs> to open my door. He was... He did it for he you. Super courteous. But even if he saying. went too far, he did it for you. I I don't believe it. I don't, I'm not positive he saw me. He was he parked so fast and like kind of ran in. I just think it's funny. He I, did I it for you. Yeah. Just imagine if somebody like gave you a kidney or something and you made fun of the kidney afterwards. <laughs> Look at this dumb bitch with one kidney. <laughs> Look, <at this> <laughs> kidney. Look, they put this kidney in my fucking. They put this kidney in my body backwards. Look at this gross ass <laughs> scar this guy has. Yeah. <laughs> did you guys ever donate a kidney? <laughs> would did we? Would you? Oh, I guess to save. I would, yeah. Family members. Yeah, who's it for? Is my question. Is it for Hitler? A locked no. one. Would my my it? mom donated a kidney to one of her family members, which makes me think I'm going to have to eventually donate a kidney to, to her. My mom. So I think she started a chain reaction that I'll be an asshole if I don't continue. Frankly, kind of a selfish move on her part. I'd like to call dibs on Tommy's kidney. You want Tommy's kidney? Yeah. Mm. You think it's a you're gonna stand in the way of the Walker train of kidneys? Yeah, I'd like to derail. Are the family's them. passing kidneys down, Correct. and you're just gonna grab one. I'd actually like the Walkers to just be the the kidney farm for my family. <laughs> okay, all right, that, that's <laughs> fine. Send us to San Diego. I'll <laughs> tell you what, if I donated a kidney, I would never stop talking about it. Yeah, yeah uh, I'd just course, be yeah. bringing it up in every conversation. Yeah, because like you can't. That's not like uh, giving like to charity. That's giving a piece of your body. Yeah, a pretty vital piece. I know you but not, it can't be that I know you have two. I know you have two. But a lot of people need kidney transplants. So obviously, what if if you only got one? Should we I'll, tear organs? Yeah, what no, other I mean, organs can you on. donate without I think you having can, a serious problem? Can you do a liver? I no. think you need your liver. You no, no, I think you can liver. Isn't you can, there some sort of thing you can do something with your liver to make uh there's something there. Obviously you can't live without a liver. I don't it's right know. there in the name. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Wow, I didn't even think about yeah, that. <laughs> get rid of your Shit. liver. <laughs> You're not a liver Fuck, anymore, dude. <laughs> Who wouldn't want a piece? Oh uh, no, that's I don't. Okay, <laughs> that's 
imagine you donate a kidney and someone gives you a screen printed shirt from Amazon. <laughs> that was really selfless of you. I thought we would commemorate it by. <laughs> oh, contains recycled parts. That's kind of cool. Is that what kidneys are? You have two kidneys, right? Oh, that's not yeah. what kidneys look like, is it? Those are those, yeah. those look like lungs. Kidney I, beans. Those look like air pods. They look like beans. Like kidney beans. Yeah. Yeah, what are the other what are the other things you can donate? Who just threw that ball? What do people donate? People like How you like LL and cool and shit. Yeah. yeah. You do look cool, Kyle. You look so cool. Yeah, I don't know. I want to get like this is whenever I'm wearing something like this, I want to get head. <laughs> cool head. <laughs> adulterous head. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I could see that. I could see you getting head in this for sure. You know what I mean? Yeah. This is like a this is a head outfit. Yeah, this is like smoke a this blunt is, and get some yeah, head. Yeah, we have yeah. talked about this. Yeah. It's, I mean, I'm speaking my truth. <laughs> get some cool ass head. What organs can you donate? A kidney, a lobe. A lobe of your liver. That's well. There you go. Yeah, yeah, part of your liver. Part yeah. of your liver. Yeah. Section your intestine. A part of your pancreas. Okay. Bone marrow is one, I guess. Well, imagine blood, asking obviously. somebody's intestine. The cord blood shit yeah. is wild. Like you save it. Mm -hmm. Like when you have a baby, you save some of their cord blood, and then that could like save their life at some point. Uh, is that how it works? I don't know. I never heard. I of think that. the umbilical cord is like uh, part of it shrivels up. Uh, once the liquid's like removed from it, and like you can technically eat it, and that's like good no, nutrients. No, but that's not what I'm talking about. That's a different thing entirely. I'm talking about when you you have a baby, you, they save something that like could save the baby's life in future. That I didn't know. I never heard of that. I this might be made up. Isn't that what they save? Stephanie sounded like she was saying something smart there. It did. Uh, and we cut her off. Let's cut her off. The woman was shit. saying something smart. We're like, no. <laughs> We're going to figure this out ourselves. What she's doing. We're going to say some fucking wild shit that we don't have any idea about. Something about stem cells. Oh, that's what it is. Oh, they always be talking about stem cells. Yeah. Just like regrow a whole mm -hmm. baby from the stem cells. I think that's what they do. Are you guys hooping today, Titus? Oh, I can't. I got a friend in town that I got to go meet up with. But What time? I would love to. Uh, we do it right after the act. No, I can't. <laughs> Thanks for asking, though. Will you ever? Will I you get one get run shape. out. You don't, no, you don't. Well, y'all make me no, get. You, I can't it's run. Like how I, short this court is, Titus. I can't run multiple times up and down this court without really having a problem. <sighs> it's not. You don't have to be in shape. You don't have do to it. be in shape, dude. It's five on five. You're in better that. shape than I am. Maybe that will get you in better shape. Yeah. Play one game. A basset hound's on my sock. What? A basset hound's on my socks. My kids bought me socks for Christmas, and I, I broke them out today, and there's basset hounds and hot air balloons on my socks. So suck on that. That's pretty cool. Yeah. What's with this bobcat? It's behind my house. Uh, there's uh, Without anybody living in my house right now, it's on 200 acres of land. Um, without anybody living there and uh, without human activity, the animals have crept up towards the house a lot more. And they're using the yard as uh, kind of feeding areas at night. And um, so I have hogs, I have deer, and I have a bobcat, apparently. Who wins that fight? The bobcat, bobcat? Eats, the, the bobcat eats the hogs, and the hogs are probably good for the deer because the bobcat's going to eat the hogs before it's going to eat the deer. But the bobcat will eat both of them. Damn. Yeah. That it's, is a big-ass bobcat. It's a bobcat. big boy. It's a big boy. It's about 30 yards south of my house. Fuck. Ooh, yeah, and that's the I first like one that. we've ever. We got gators now too. What? Gators. You got Jumanji in your backyard? Oh, those are the pigs. Those are the hogs. Yeah. These are your pigs? Uh, these are from my game camera that's uh behind my oh, house. Oh, I didn't know. Cool. So it it's a camera that if you put it there, and something walks by it, it takes a picture of them or a video. I want to see the bobcat eat something on the camera. I don't know if he'll do it right out there in front. That's a big old boy right there. Um, uh, but that's pointing actually towards my house. It spins sometimes. Got it. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. Yeah. You just watch it at night. No, it sends when when it when it takes a picture, it sends it to your phone. Oh. So it lets you know you have something. Already gave Brandon a heads up. I'm gonna do a Bigfoot thing on his property. I like. Not gonna know when, but just yeah. Could be in I'm a in. month. Could be in like eight months. Who knows? I'm in. But, but if you already told me that whenever it happens, I'll know it was. No, you won't. You'll forget. You forget. You have a bad memory. So. <laughs> what was the thing that I had to forget. do? Oh. 
I gotta make you eat a razor blade. What? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, no, <laughs> that's, that's gonna right. suck yeah, that's for right. you. I know. I completely that. forgot about that, but that will happen. Yeah, that was on me. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna have a razor blade in your food at some point. I think the right swallow and chew procedure would leave me harmless. I think it'd be pretty scary if you bite. Yeah. Really tough to pull that off, though. The swallow and the small enough razor. If it's too small, though, I think you, if you swallow a small razor whole, I think yeah, then no, it does I, damage I once it gets down there. Th- yeah, yeah, I wouldn't do that. Yeah. Mm. Um, we got to do a fellow Friday soon too. Yeah, we really. Yeah, I have a stack of them. You do? How about look ne- at one just right now? What about next week before oh, the Super Bowl? Prepare it right. My fellows are like evolving out of fellowhood because I've had them for too long. Oh, they're growing too much. Yeah. We could do next week, although next Friday, uh, oh, a very yeah. special guest is coming by the office. Yeah. One mm-hmm. Christopher Ber- B- uh, Berman. Wow. Schwam. Yeah. Huh. Schwam is going to come. He wants to come. It's incredible. He's going to play some Pebble. He said he wants to do the podcast, play some Pebble Beach, have some lunch. Gauntlet. Unbelievable. Gauntlet. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Schwam doing the gauntlet would be all time. He wouldn't do it, right? I think we're going to figure out either he's going to maybe call pick up hoops or should we do a home run derby? Back, 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 back. Yeah. You know. He said he's down for everything. You yeah. said that he wants to be here and That would out. be funny, but imagine these idiots playing pickup basketball with Chris Berman calling it. That, yeah. yeah. That would also be funny. Like Max taking it to the, taking it to the basket with Chris Berman calling his. Amazing. That's true. Yeah. So, wait, what's the uh, fallout from from Nate's radio today? Is, is the fight back on? TJ, um, it was still going when I was when we started, but I don't know. I saw Francis put out a statement video. I haven't watched it. Yet. Oh, can we watch it? Let's yeah. watch it. Yeah. Caucasian Kanye. That was so good. <laughs> Got by his Aaron. dark twisted flow back. <laughs> oh yeah. Here we are in the office kitchen area again, and it's Bagel Friday, which is a very risky day for my coworkers who made New Year's resolutions to lose weight for their weddings this spring or beach season, which is never as far away as people think it is. It's very easy to let yourself go in the cold, dark months of winter under blankets and hoodies and then find yourself facing the garish light of sun and warmth and having to put on a bathing suit before you're ready. Uh Uh-uh, don't let it happen and I won't which is exactly why, for my coworkers' sake, I scooped all the bagels. Oh. That's right. I turned these 1,200-calorie hockey pucks of fat into 400-calorie treats. <laughs> Guilt-free. You're welcome, guys. Just doing my part. <laughs> you know? Somebody had to step up. I like it. I love Francis. That was his response. What What is he responding was to? Was there some bagel slander in the... Uh, no, I think there was something, like, they were saying Francis was... Nate was in everyone's head so much that Francis went out and bought 100 bagels. Damn, Clemmer and Nate, where the hell you been? Yeah, he's been... They, Nate does kind of live a little bit rent-free in people's head right now, in this moment. Felt, I could feel it in the office. Okay. You ain't got no fucking Nate in your Serato? <laughs> Uh, Nate was at. We went to a dinner on Wednesday night for Erica. Nate was there. Zero Bond. <laughs> this is like an exclusive club in New York. It's called Zero Bond. Yeah. Sounds like a like an ass powder. A what? Ass powder? Yeah. Yeah, I guess it does. Like Gold Bond medicated powder. Zero Bond. Zero Bond. Yeah, there's no calories. In yeah. It. It's a loveless marriage. Zero Zero Bond. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. There's that too. It's like the Hall of Fame. Mm. Oh, good one, Brandon. You guys are rolling. There you go. Hell yeah, Brandon. It's like if Pierce Brosnan died. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, well, Daniel Craig. There'd still be alive. a lot of bonds. Da- like Daniel Craig also died. If well, Pierce Brosnan. We still got Sean, Sean Connery. Connery he's dead. Died. Well, Roger Moore's and Roger definitely Moore not probably alive. Is dead. Ooh. Who is the new Bond? Have they said? I think Daniel Craig came back, didn't he? Or He's back? 
Didn't they say it was going to be Idris Elba, and then it wasn't? And no, they never. I don't think they ever said. I think that was like the fan fiction. I think there is a new one. Though, I think you're right. Fake there Idris Elba because it makes a lot of sense. But yeah, uh, he yeah. would be an awesome Bond. He would be. Yeah, he would be awesome. I never watched any of the Bond movies. Yeah. I didn't watch any of the old ones. I have watched the like Casino Royale and uh, Quantum of Solace and Are all they those. Good? They're really good. Yeah, they're great movies. They're really fucking. Just the same movie every time though. Eh, you kind of know that. It's like yeah, no, I don't hate on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, similar, sure. But yeah, still great. That's why you, that's why we love them. It's gonna Tom, be a gonna be a hot ass woman. Uh, it's gonna be some chases. Gonna be some bombs. Somebody's gonna turn on somebody. Some sick technology. Yep. Some new cutting edge thing. Yeah. Like some that. British quips. I remember the the Pierce Brosnan one where he like summoned his car on his like phone, which yeah. you can actually do now. But like, in the yeah, 90s, you can do that. In the nineties, I was so sick. Yeah. I gotta watch a Bond, I guess. Next James Bond favorites, 2024. Here are the 13 actors most likely to succeed. Daniel Craig is 007. Does he have to be British? Hmm. Well, yeah, right? Like, actually British. I think so. Are they all British? Is Roger Moore British? Aaron Tyler. Two. Uh, pass. Don't yeah, know no, him. that's not no. a Bond guy. Maybe. Yes. Yeah, that's too a Bond beefy, guy. too beefy. Okay. That's he was too Superman, beefy. too. He can't be Superman and James Bond. No. 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 James Norton, no. Uh, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, he looks But then cool. I can't really see myself as Bond. <laughs> yeah, representation matters. You're yeah. Right. No. He'd be pretty good. You oh. don't. All right, who's this? Reggie Jean P. Yeah, I think so. We need a 5'7 James Bond. <laughs> <laughs> With cauliflower ear. No, he's not James Bond. <laughs> I. Ah, uh, he's think, anything. He's anything he, he wants be. to he's be. He's a villain. I he's a villain. He no, could be. he's anything he wants to be. Who's this? Is Tom this Hardy. Stand-up? Oh, Tom Hardy, definitely. Tom Hardy Although a little beat. Yeah. No, he's yes. too thick. He might be too thick. Yes. Sope so- Driso? No. no. Ginger Bond? Um, no. Maybe. I'm Daniel Craig. Ain't the- yeah, why not? Who's that? <laughs> Pop- Papa Acido? No. No. Oh, no, uh, no. I kind of like him. His name's Callum. Callum? That's kind of... Is, is this the guy that's dating Dua Lipa? Yeah, I oh think my you're God. right. He might be Bond. I could tell. He might be Bond. Yes. Ooh. That's, uh, it's that's Bond. Richard Madden. Yes. That's a Bond. Oh, it's like the Bachelor. Richard though. Nixon. That's a Bond face right there. Yeah, that is a Bond face. Dick Madden. Hmm. Ooh. No. Oh, this guy's Ewing. He's a villain. 21st. Yeah, you're right. He what if he's, Bond he's took a, a turn, though? He, he's a guy who turns on Bond. They're yeah. friends. They work together. He's one of the other agents. He didn't take the he's training. He's 008 or something. He dropped out of the training. Yeah. Or yeah. And, then, and then now Bond has to go kill him yeah. because he's got all the secrets to mm-hmm. everything. That's what his role in the movie is. Let Michael Scott be Bond. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. James Bonfire. That would be sick. I just call him Michael Scott because I... F- Oftentimes forget Steve Carell's name. Mm-hmm. I want to see Victor Wembanyama in a movie just to just see to how see ridiculous it? that would look. Because actors are notoriously short. Shorter yeah, than I think. he th- Embiid. That clip of Embiid seeing him for the first time, yeah. like up close and being like, "Holy fuck, yeah. he's tall," was pretty funny. That was looking at like a, a slideshow, and everything looked. It was yeah, it made my like, jaw drop. It's crazy to watch an NBA game and like guys like Steph Curry are considered small, and mm-hmm. he, isn't he six three? Six three. Yeah. yeah. So if he walked in here, we'd just be like, "Oh, he's, he's taller tall. than everyone." Mm-hmm. You guys fucking gotta start talking about your height more often. What do you mean? Everyone thinks I'm five four, because you guys are six. How tall five. are you, Mark? I was six four. I probably have shrunk. Yeah. As I've gotten older. It is the thing I get the most people surprised how how, how big I am. How tall are you? I'm six five. Six two and a half. No, you're not. Yeah, yeah. Six four. No, I'm six two and a half. Oh. My dad was six three and he's wow. I always wanted to get to six three and never got there. Mm. Or is it or are you a disappointment because of that? I think I'm a disappointment for yeah. a lot of other reasons. Height's probably not one of them. They should remake uh Enter the Dragon with Wembenyama. Was that the Kareem Abdul Jabbar Bruce Lee movie? Oh, I don't think that was the one. It, it might have been. It might have been. Who's coming to Royal Rumble tomorrow night? Uh, just right now, the mostly sports guys. But you're welcome to come if you'd like to come watch the Rumble. We'll see how I'm feeling. I got uh, Dis- <laughs> Disney on Ice tomorrow. 
Ooh. Game oh, of death. Game of death. That's sick. You could have saved money, man. You could have just come out to my house, and I could have put on Disney on Ice for you. I would have loved to see that. I could have just, I could have dressed up as <laughs> Cinderella and Snow White, all those people, done a nice show, got some lights. Would be easy. Yeah, I'm not super pumped for Disney on Ice, but that's you know. You just can't be. I feel bad. Yeah, you just honest. have to do it. Just hope the kids enjoy it. Are we gonna lose the ice next week? We're losing it right now. Yeah, I mean, like I had no snow. It's gonna be fifty next week. We're we're getting the we're getting false hope. We're gonna get one. But of it's the, too early for false hope. Like we need true. We're, we're not falling for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. False hope has to happen in first week of March. March, yeah. It's, yes, that's when forties. Yeah, sometimes the next, it's April. That's when Shit. the trap happens. I've been looking for. I've been looking at the weather every day, hoping for sun for my guy KB. <sighs> praying on oh, sun. They dropped it down. They had it at fifty one at one point. I'm all right. I've been praying on sun. Vegas will help, right? I don't know if sun was the issue. Oh, it was the weed. I think it was weed, general grief. Yeah. But I've been yeah. running, and running is probably the best thing. Because li- I was lifting too much because I was afraid to burn too many calories. But right. A long-distance run will measure the best. Clears your mind. Change yeah. your mood. I just hate it so much every second of it. Do you run, Titus? Yeah, oh, yeah. On the street? Yeah, only I can't do treadmills. I only do I could see streets. you running on the street. Do you oh. run on the street, KB? I just do treadmills. Yeah. I'm not good. Like I don't. I run a lot, but I don't. Right. I'm not getting better. I don't have any. My like, titties pace jiggle of, too much. Agreed. Of note, it's always a problem when I run. Yeah. And you can't also, as bigger men, you can't trust every treadmill. Do you get self-conscious about the amount of noise you make on a treadmill? Yeah. How heavy your steps sound? I hate Correct. when it's too heavy. Yeah. yeah. I I just I I feel like I'm no, disrupting the rest of the what gym. Point of reference? Do you have on treadmills? I've tried about every six months. I'll just go. You try regularly. Yeah, so but that's why you got to run I'm, on the street because you're you're vulnerable on the treadmill. You're stuck in that spot and everybody yeah. can see you. People can walk by and. But my, I joined a gym in, in Antioch, I'm, so I have a. Membership. I didn't know you were running though. I'll try just to warm up to to lift. My problem with running on the street is that I always get to like the stoplight and I'm not a running place mm. guy. So everyone's like, "Well, this guy." Yeah, we're gassed out. That, I'm just standing yeah. there breathing heavy yeah, on the sidewalk. As fuck. Yeah. Do you at least walk around with No, I just you? stop. Oh. I'll do a dead stop and be like, hope yeah. this lasts a while. You gotta walk around aimlessly like this and look like you just like just hopping impatient. back and forth. Yeah. Even if you're not doing the running in place, look like you're pissed off about stopping. I rollerbladed I, I, I had rollerblades uh probably about eight years ago and I was like, I'm gonna start rollerblading and I went out once and I a couple stoolies saw me and I just I literally just stopped right there and walked home like I can't probably the best yeah I had shoes on with me because I was like rollerblading I was like I'm gonna go somewhere and then I was just like I'm done I just can't look cool can't be getting seen no what have been did you just leave the rollerblades right there I just walked the rollerblades home I was like fuck it (laughs) I'm done never doing this again (laughs) (laughs) it's just like it's just you can't look cool rollerblades walking around carrying rollerblades also bad bad luck luck. yeah (laughs) I think you need a hockey stick. Maybe if I start rollerblading that with a hockey stick. That is true. If you stick, have the, just have a stick in your hand. Yeah. That changes everything. People are like, oh, shit. What is he doing? What is he up to? I want to play some roller hockey. We got to get a floor ball in here. I would love floor hockey on this. Floor, floor hockey floor. would ruin the floors, but there is like a one that's designed for wood floors that we could get. That would be sick. Next week we have on – Wednesday. I don't even know if I'm allowed to announce it, but I'm going to. Uh, we have a, a real handball team coming, so we're going to play some handball. Oh, let's go. I've been seeing a lot of their videos lately. Yeah. Like the satisfying. The good handball. Yeah. The Olympic like the, style. The, the, right. The, not the you, slap it against the wall. Handball. No, the, with like right. gold point line stuff. and all yeah, that. Because yeah. we have a long standing uh, rivalry with handball because it is the one Olympic sport where it's like if. You know, we make the jokes about soccer, like if our best athletes played soccer. Like, handball, if you just were like Patrick Mahomes, you're playing handball, he would rule. Yeah. We talked about this. Yeah. I said mm, he needs two years. I don't a think year? so. You think he could do it in a month? And they get very upset because they're like, no, it takes a lot of skill. But, like, you can't tell me if the, you if you just had a team like Josh Allen playing handball, who you would not be the best player? But there's so much that's like so much experience that he'd have to gain. I don't think he would. It'd be like Josh, just run some people over and throw it in the top left corner. But they put like spin on it. There's a stick element. But he throws it so much harder than all these. But guys. there is a technical aspect. But they probably have some hard throwers. Have I, mean, I think it would be, be an elite level handball. Month tops. Yeah. 
Like, look at it. You're telling me Patrick Mahomes wouldn't be elite at this game? Well, this isn't the game. I don't know. No, that's <laughs> that's that a penalty it's shot. Seen? I don't know. Let him cook. Oh, that is true. That was some. But nobody's defending that. This it's is. Pika. I think that's that's a, that's a that's a penalty shot, Brady. Right, I it's understand happening. that. But yeah. th that's why I said that's not the game. This is the game. Yeah, but tell me, Josh Allen wouldn't be the best handball player? That's crazy. Patrick Holmes with all his arm angles. Oh wow. How could you say that that wouldn't be? I didn't. I didn't. Yeah. I'm just. I, I'm going to have to stick with my gut. You think so? Uh, there's like European countries who like that's their national sport. There's no way. There has to be a technical. Like would he snap the ball around the court like this? Would he yeah. learn how to do that? I think he'd just throw it to whatever spot he wants to throw it to. He got to be able to throw left-handed? Oh, uh, he can? Oh, that, that yeah. goalkeeper wasn't very athletic. I think the goalie is just guessing. Like. I don't okay. think there's – I don't know how much. I'm probably wrong. But also, they put spider tack all over the ball. So, Garrett Cole would be awesome at it? Yeah. <laughs> like, listen. listen. <laughs> what? They load up on spider tack. And they put it on their shoes so that they can load up more during the game action. Are those not sticky enough? Miserable. Yeah, they all look miserable. What the hell? Yeah, they're like, I wish I was playing a real I wish I was playing for the Chiefs. <laughs> yeah. Why does it look like nobody wants to play handball? <laughs> what was that? What was that? <laughs> Never mind. I'm on your side. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm not, <laughs> Mark, I'm not saying... Agree? I'm not making the argument... Yeah, I agree. I think you um, could, yeah. yeah. I'm not making the argument that we could be elite at handball. I'm just no, saying but that pack, our uh, like best a, athletes... Even yeah, like White, oh, White Sox off. Dave with the yeah. cannon he has. That was month. sick. Give him a month. Jay Cutler. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Now now we're talking. That was sick. <laughs> that was awesome. Because, like, there's a certain... Oh, my goodness. I think it comes down to the fact that, like, there's a certain amount of, like, arm torque everyone can yeah. physically have. Yeah. And it's I would assume... Three to five weeks for a Baseball start. players, yeah. like pitchers, have the greatest arm torque. Mm-hmm. I could watch this all day. It's a nice size ball too. It's very throwable ball. If right, that makes sense. Oh, uh, so Josh Allen can make that throw for sure. Right, dresser win. Could yeah, I'm sure there is a technique to it, but most of these highlights don't really have. Right, much, like Jacob much, Degrom wouldn't be throwing like the, the ball. Greatest no, ball player. That one is okay. That's that one. Sick. That one's pretty sick. That refutes my point, but most oh, oh. pocket it back and throw it. She got smashed. Is this so? The, what team is coming in? I don't know. Just a handball team? Church yeah. league or a pro team? I think it's a pro team. Church oh. <laughs> oh. TJ, remind me. Maybe next week or the week after we have to play that, that game, the um, blindfolded uh, goal game where you just lay there and you goal roll ball. it. Yeah, goal ball. Yeah, it's like a parallel. Oh, sport. yeah. That looked awesome. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. yeah. We, we showed now. that on the here. Can we play? Can we just can we do it real quick right now? Ro just real quick, just one round of it. We what do you need? Two goals? Yeah, we got the two what? goals right there. Let's do Con it. Get Connor out here. Set it up. What? Show it to us. Show show I us. I gotta the find a non-Paralympic clip though, Doc. So, or oh, DMCI. Wait, the what? DMCI. They're they're Olympics. Oh. Olympics doesn't fuck around. Yeah, Looks cool with that hat too. They are motherfuckers. Oh, Season yes. Three. This is like a customized goal. <laughs> it's awesome. <laughs> the rollers are, they're all blindfolded. Yes, okay. We could just do it one, we could just, yeah. Do, yeah. They're all we, different, yeah, they're all vision. Can we just so play this real quick? Do we have blindfolds? Oh. Oh. Yeah, do, don't we have blindfolds? Set up, set up both goals. Oh, yeah, we could play this. What happened to those Jerry After Dark blindfolds? Best blindfolds ever. Those were ones in mostly sports and ones in the room you're in. I thought we had a bunch of those. We had three at least. Oh, we had three. Let's just play one round of two v two. Well, who's gonna commentate? We're just gonna go out there. Che and TJ. Okay. Connor, Ken. Yeah. So do we have matching goals? Yeah, we do. We have what are we playing to? Let's play to twenty-one. <laughs> Let's play to three. Three feels right. Three feels right. 
I, I'll be honest, I couldn't really see it without my. Show it one more time. What, what, just tell me what. I have so to we do. have blindfolds on, and you roll the ball. So I like my chair. Sorry. Trying to roll it, and then you try to get in front of it by sound. It's like a, it's uh, like a kickball. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, now are you? This game is gonna rock. Are you on your knees, and then you lay down when the ball's? Coming? I think you could lay down the whole time if you want. Yeah, but you wouldn't be able to really but, move that way. The chat is saying it's a special ball that has a bell inside of it, so that they can hear it. Oh no shit. I don't, okay, well I that's cool. I don't. I don't. Know. That. If it's rolling, we won't be able to hear it unless it's bouncing. I think you have to bounce. You have to bounce it a little bit. I think you have to have a little bounce to it. Throw it in a rugged way. Oh, there's right, that the bell. Yeah, yeah, I okay. heard the bell. All right, I do believe Can it. Can we attach a bell? Oh, this is going to be fun. Is this ableist of us? No. Okay. Oh, these are disabled people? They're, they're vision blind. impaired. So they're all blindfolded so that they're equally vision impaired. Right, so I don't think that as long as we're blindfolded, it's fair, right? Yeah, you're vision impaired. Is that, is that too close? No. Oh. These goals? That seems close. I think you got to go one back. Far though. Yeah. Um... Yeah, yeah, go one back. Go red lines, Connor. All oh, right, so we I need think green line to green line. And we need we need we need blindfolds. 2v2. Game to 3? Sure. This is just a test. Yeah, see if it works. And we'll scale it up later. The other thing I'd love to do at some point is get like if get there's like a chair. Chicago wheelchair basketball team and have like our 5 in wheelchair versus their 5 in wheelchairs. Ooh. That would be I think the uh what team is Scotty Barnes on currently? They had they just did that. The Raptors. The Raptors, yeah. Okay. All right, so everyone blindfold. Connor, you're gonna call the game. What is that? Where'd you get blindfold? You're gonna call the game. The okay. Fields. Hmm. All right, so who's what are the teams? Me and Brandon. I don't oh, know. That was stupid of me. Where do we have a kickball? EJ, EJ, you gotta. There's a blue kickball out there somewhere. There's definitely a kickball out there. You can turn that mic on right there. Yep. Testing, testing. Here we go. Oh wait. We're looking for blindfolds. Brandon is getting changed. Yeah. All right, folks, here with TJ and Zah in the booth. Big Cat setting up. Love this music. Everybody's putting on their blindfolds right now. And it looks like we are about to get underway. What are the teams looking like? No idea. It looks like there's some confusion over if they're allowed to be playing right now on the court because we don't know. But we're gonna do it anyway. Some random people walking onto the court right now. A lot of confusion. Okay. Brandon has secured his blindfold. So is Big Cat. If we're being totally honest, I have no idea what this game is. Goal ball. It's a vision-impaired Paralympic sport. Thank you, TJ. God, KB looks so cool. Hello, Che. Brandon looks so much less cool than KB does. That would be great. I don't think they have any idea where they are on the court right now. Big Cat just scored. I don't know if we're playing for real right now, but he just scored on Brandon. Brandon had no idea Chay where just, he was. Chay just asked me, can they hear? <laughs> That's, <laughs> what kind of question is that? <laughs> All right, Big Cat. Down on his knees. Brandon takes a shot. Big Cat looking to save it. No, that's going to go in. That's a score for Brandon, but I don't know if it counts. 
KB can fully see right now. He does not have the blindfold on, and I don't know exactly what he's doing. That would be a good strategy if KB just cheated and took his blindfold off ready? without them knowing. Yeah. 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 It's his birthday. He can do what he wants. Yeah, All right, now he's putting true. it on. So the teams are Brandon and Big Cat. Okay, here we go. And versus KB and Titus. Versus yeah. KB and Titus. Okay, gotcha. All right, folks, we're underway. Now we are going. Big Cat rolls this one straight down the court, and that's going to be stopped by KB. Blindfolded, KB makes the save. Nobody knows where the ball is. Spider's going to have to go and retrieve it. And now Spider puts the ball back in play, hands it off to KB, right in goal. Really don't know what the strategy here is aside from just rolling it as fast as you can down the court. So they would stand up and like do like a spin throw. So that must be meta. Brandon and Big Cat are going with a defensive strategy here. They're laid out across the yep. goal. Brandon's foot is about three feet short of the right post though. Gaby's looking for a reference point to figure out where his back is facing. And he is Titus facing is doing it. downward dog, not really helping. Yeah. Titus also looks very confused. Yeah, Titus His looks like he... His mouth is wide open. Yeah. Like, what the hell is Titus going on? Titus almost looks like he's in some sort of hostage situation. <laughs> KB is angled very much to the left. If he rolls this straight, this is going all the way into the kitchen. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it does roll. Truly. Into the kitchen. <laughs> not close to anything. Right, right into a, yeah, a shoot over there. Um... But Spider, Spider retreats. I did put it at the free throw lines, and they said, no, move them back, move them back. We want to go further. Yeah. So uh, right, this could be ugly. You ready? Surprisingly, yeah, cool. this sport that is played in the Paralympics, not so easy. Yeah. Oh, 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 Titus with the save. Or maybe I'm wrong. Acrobatic with his left leg. Because that one was bouncing a little bit, and he was able to deflect it in the air. So now he gets the rebound. He's trying to figure out where he is. Yep, he is right in front of his own net. Somebody needs to start like walking up the floor here. Yeah, you could just walk all the way across the floor and place the ball in the goal, and they wouldn't know. Here comes Titus. Strong roll, and that's going to be easily blocked by Brandon. I mean, they're just laid fully out on the yeah. floor. It might be beneficial to find big body blinds, triple Bs for this sort of game. BB. <laughs> <laughs> big body. If you find like the biggest body blind you can find, like a sumo wrestler with a blindfold on, the same concept if there was like blindfolded hockey, I guess. I feel like this one's gonna be good from Big Cat. Nope, that is going to be far right. Wide right. Wide right. Shout out Buffalo. Oh, I got an idea. What? Do we have mouse traps though? Oh, we do, but because stand by. Yeah, does anybody know how to set them? TJ is looking for a mousetrap, folks. Stephanie has taken over the camera. Here comes KB. I think you shouldn't tell us what you're going to throw. It's, it's harder that way, and that's better. KB processing here. Fakes it. Fakes it again as if anybody is biting on this fake. And he goes wide left again. Into the kitchen again. I got it. Can I, oh, yeah. can I look for a second just to see? I feel like I'm so turned around. TJ. I'm looking for one second. Was okay. just on the approach. Yeah, all right, I'm way over here. Okay, all right. All yeah. Right. <laughs> I think that movie's closer. Who's, who's we're good, we're good. Ball. Okay, all right, ball, ball. Yeah, Big Cat took off his blindfold right as TJ was on the approach. So TJ's going to have to now go back out. He's maneuvering around with a mousetrap. Brandon with a strike, and that's saved at the last second by KB. KB knocks it away. That's going to go out of play. No idea where TJ is, but he does have a mouse trap in hand, and this could get interesting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Brandon sensed it. Brandon sensed it. Oh, he's feeling around. Brandon's feeling around. He knows it's there. Oh, 
What is Spider doing? Oh, it's reflected. Oh, and it's... <laughs> KB's on his head. K KB's on his head. What? KB was doing a head handstand, and he deflected the ball away. No, I hear it. What the hell is going on? The past minute. And Brandon, yeah, Brandon's not putting his hands on the floor. Brandon has his arms fully crossed. Wait, did they throw it? Did they throw it? Let me warn him. I don't know. I just threw it. It's turning. For the podcast listeners, Che is standing right in front of the main camera. Brandon rolls that one down. Gotcha. Don't bitch. And Titus. Comes away with a block. Che, I thought, was going to just snatch that himself, even though Che does not have a blindfold on and is just roaming around willy-nilly. Here comes Titus. That was a fast pitch, but that's going to go wide right. TJ still maneuvering around with a mousetrap, trying to find the right moment to strike. He's behind the, uh, the body armor. Yeah, now he's coming in at midcourt. Oh, I lost count. Connor and Stephanie in the booth. Za, to our right. You guys go. <laughs> Brandon really has the technique Yo, down of rolling cool. along the. That's a soft one, and Brandon what? celebrating even though it's nowhere near the net. Yep. No. Oh, he does. He does. He does. He does. No, but he's not. Oh, he does. <laughs> he, did, he did put it down. Titus. Titus. Oh. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Sirs. It's a veteran move by TJ, but it didn't work oh, out. He's, it's still in play. Oh, oh. It's play. It's still in play. No, 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 no. I'm here. Come on. Come on, Mark. No, they're staying away from it. No, no, no. He's going to put his hand down. He's going to put his hand down. Did they throw it? Oh my god. It'll, it'll come back. Oh. <laughs> yeah. TJ has grabbed another mousetrap. A second mousetrap is in play. All right, first goal win. Also, KB okay. keeps pump faking as if he's going <laughs> to fake anybody out. Someone Nobody yeah. knows yeah. that he's, he even has the ball. Oh, Big Cat do, taking defense on mousetraps just by bouncing the ball and trying to set them all off. Yep, see? There he goes. This is... I think he's still missing I think it's still outside his left leg. This look from Brandon is interesting. <laughs> oh my god, Mark, Mark, look at Mark. Mark's about to hit it. Mark is dangerously close to a mousetrap. Now he's not. He just got out of the way. No hesitation for Mark. Rolls that straight down, but again, wide right. Oh, there we go. Oh. How is everybody not? How is nobody putting it on? Should we move him closer? All right, let's go. All right. Oh, they're taking the, they're taking the blindfold off. Oh, Mark. Grab it, Chief. Chief, 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 Chief. Grab it, Chief. Grab it, Chief. Smart, smart. Yeah, all right. Nice. All right. No, no, they're going to go on their way. Smart play by Che. Saves the mouse trap before anybody sees it. TJ is <laughs> spiraling right now. Alright, don't let us pass the red. Don't let us pass the red. Yeah. Yep. TJ's just trying to stay out of plain sight. He's also wearing camo today, which is very funny. He's just trying to stay out of anything. Yeah. But now blindfolds are back on, except for KB. But it looks like we're about to get back on the way here. The nets have been brought closer together. Well, I mean, we should we'll be. play to three still. Right? Yeah. Because you guys are about to score on this one. And I don't well, you don't know that. Yeah, I do. All right, you ready? Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Ball in. Oh, <laughs> Titus. Titus played cute. Oh. oh. <laughs> what a save. What a save. Oh, save by Titus. Oh, what a save. Oh. Now we gotta get Almost that. slipped through on the rebound, but Titus up? saves it. And now Titus... Retains possession. Looks like he's going to give it off to KB. KB, can he score the game winner right here on his birthday? We're stopping this game after one. Brandon. This is the hardest, this is the hardest game you've had to call? Yeah, by a mile. I have no idea what's happening. 
Baseball, basketball, football, I've done it. This, I have no oh, idea. Yeah. Oh, 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 Big Cat, can you stop oh, oh, the oh, redirect? Oh, oh, oh. He does. He does. Big body. Should we do no lying down? Probably too easy. Oh, but, oh my god, a mouse trap is right in front of his nose. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, and Spider, get the yeah, fucking mouse trap because he's going to open his eyes. That would have been... Oh, no. yeah, scoot, scoot. This entire company would have been bad. Like, the, everything would have fallen to, to pieces. So, rules are no lying down now. Are, are uh, the mouse traps still in play? Are they going to put their hands on the floor? Oh, this. that could slip right through the middle. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. Last second yes. save by KV. Oh. Big cat's big cat's taking a goal line stance. Uh, TJ's gone rogue. Nobody knows where he is. Salad him, Titus. Through his legs. <laughs> Give him a salad. Uh, that's what we call in your kind of English. It's called the nutmeg. Ah. In my kind of English, we call it the salad. All right, here comes Titus. This one has potential. I don't know if Big Cat knows it's coming. Oh! That was the spot. That was good. That was good. That was the spot. Good goaltending. Oh, he knew there was no Oh! God damn it. Brandon is poor Brandon. I kind of feel sorry for Brandon with the with the mouse traps. I know I'm not allowed to say that. No, 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 that's fine. You don't have to admit it if he comes back and asks about yeah, it. Yeah, so I'm gonna. What is that? <laughs> oh! oh he hit it! Oh, what a goal! Wait. The first person to go over him with the throw, <laughs> and he sinks it. <laughs> that was incredible. Now my only question is, is that a legal move? I think it is. Are we going up to the booth for some VAR action? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think that Titus and KB knew that he threw it. Oh, now they know. Okay, so now, now, they know. <laughs> now it becomes a whole lot harder to defend now, which is, which is good. All right. KB once again, milking every single second of this. He's facing the exact wrong direction. Okay, now he's lining up properly. TJ's right outside of Brandon, by the way. Yep, he's up to something where he's standing. <laughs> oh. Oh, off the post. Off the post. Oh, Big Cat heard that mousetrap land, by the way. Yeah. That was also yeah, a very athletic play from Big Cat to keep that from going in. I was so locked in on the mousetrap situation. Yeah. I can't mm -hmm. look at, can't watch anything else. TJ, TJ's, TJ, eyes up top. See, now Big Cat's actually moving a little bit. Uh, I thought it was going to go closer to the net. Uh, no, nah, that yeah, one goes wide left. Right, right, right. Uh, <laughs> KB has his angles down. Oh, you're already done. Yeah, I want to sneak it down. Oh, I can't get down. Oh, oh, oh. Nope. Way wide. I, I TJ has come back into the booth. Uh, that was wide? Like, can we take the blindfolds off and try it? <laughs> what the fuck? Are there any mouse traps at play, TJ? There's one in front of Titus. Okay, cool. How bad is this to watch me? Oh, Titus getting down in a crouch. It's so funny watching people blindfolded. There is every single person who's at the office right now is watching, by the way. There's a crowd of people on the back. <laughs> oh, Brandon scores oh! again! <laughs> That's two for Brandon. He's going for a hat trick next, folks. Two nil. Oh yeah, we got some people locked in. I thought we were stopping after one. Two nothing right now. Okay, Big Cat and Brandon lead. Titus and KB still trying to get on the board. KB sizing up his shot. He's trying to put some spin on it. That one goes right towards Brandon. And it saved off his shin. Do you think he thought it was a mouse trap? He thought that ball was a mouse trap. TJ, what you done to him? He's so skittish. I think he could like feel me around and he was like swiping around. He yeah, he noticed you the very first time you went over there next to him. Oh, overhead throw. I like the bouncy save. Yeah, you're not gonna get it by rolling. The KB save is one of the greater athletic things ever accomplished by this company. Agreed. That was unbelievable. 
Titus with some physics. Yeah. Roll wide again. That's gonna be the most aggravating game. Because yeah. you don't know how you're failing. <laughs> Brandon, very, very close to a hat trick, but that's gonna go wide again. Still 2 0. Are wearing a spider 2 wide banana shirt? Yeah. Shout out John Gruden. <laughs> <laughs> Are we shouting out John Gruden? <laughs> I thought that was his play. My bad. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> you are right on that one. And there's a deep drive to left field. Yeah. Uh... That's got to be Right? Well, it's their right, it's our left. Yeah, their left. Or their right. I'm getting my lefts and rights confused, too. But that's okay. Now here comes Titus on the approach. Still staying glued to that goal post, not moving an inch forward. But this is a good roll, and he's got it. Bottom right. Bottom right corner, he's able to sink it. 2-1. Titus and KB get on the board. They call it bottom 92. Oh, what is that, Saw? Uh, bottom corner. Bottom corner. Bottom corner. Nothing real special. I don't know, top soccer. is top bins. I'm going to say that next top time. Top bins. There we go. If the ball leaves the ground, top bins. Oh. Hit it. Good save by Titus. Clean save by Titus. Now he's directing KB towards the center of the floor. And KB just goes directly <laughs> right back to the goalpost. Chat's saying 1-1. One, one. What? Chat's saying it's 1-1. One, one. No, it's not. I don't think they're counting the one that Brandon smoked in there. Oh, they're oh, not counting the Brandon throw. Yeah, they didn't count. All right, apologies. 1-1. One, one. We can't fully hear everything that's going on out there. Oh. Ooh. So 1-1. One, one. That was an illegal throw by Brandon. Again, I'll apologize for that one. No goal. Deep drive to left field. Uh... Oh, oh, shit. oh, shit. Titus just got pegged. Titus just got pegged by Big Cat. That should have bounced. Good save. Big. Who is that? I thought I didn't have my distance right. All right, Titus, come on. There is a gap dead smack in the center of this goal right now. <laughs> and Titus you went for the roly poly. Titus is rolling it maybe one and a half miles an hour. Oh god. Yeah, it's gonna go very far away. Don't tell us Brandon trying to catch him off guard. There is still through all of this a loaded no, mouse trap directly in front of where Titus is standing. Oh yeah, there is. It's almost no, impossible that he hasn't triggered yeah, it. Yeah, I know, that's why I told Spider not to say anything. Is that the one that Che stepped on once they took the blindfolds off and everything? He he tried to like make sure that they didn't see it. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to directly break someone's finger by putting it in their hand, but you know. Oh, KB. Oh, Dead smack. Oh, no. Yes. I think Big Cat just kicked Brandon in the nuts, Loki. Yeah, Big Cat and Brandon collide on the save. <laughs> they like scissored. But they did form a wall that yeah. was very successful. That's a lot of man. <laughs> Crossbar challenge. It's your throw. I was throwing it to you. There was a point where Big Cat's nose was directly I know, in front I of the mouse. I know. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> he would think it's funny, though. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I don't know how long we've been going in this, but <laughs> Big Cat just throws overheaded, and that's gonna go wide again. What do you mean out? How's that wide? Where the fuck am I shooting? Is your guy's goal still there? Clear frustration on the court right now. No, didn't I go last? Wait, how? How was that? I'll replay the headset. Focus up. Mark lining it up with his left hand. Oh, fuck. Oh! <laughs> yes. Yes. Got him. The mouse trap has been triggered. Got him. Well, that's a clean roll by Titus. 
That could get oh, bottom left corner. No. Jay Watts. Where's Jay? That's what he does. Wait, where did the mouse strap get him? Did he step on it? I think he, I think he put the ball right? on it. Yeah. Oh, was it? Okay, gotcha, gotcha. gotcha. <laughs> Blindfold and mouse trap. It's more of the shock of the situation, the loud noise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Brandon, yeah, keeps going how? wide right. I love the response of how. how? Yeah, how? <laughs> it's killing me every oh, time. Oh, you threw it. <laughs> Seems like that's the whole point of the game. So you have no idea where it's going. How? How? What? Yeah, I, I gotta learn a Brandon impression. What the hell? That's pretty good, TJ. Yeah, mine's not that good. That's me. That's me. How many how many times have you tried to do a Brandon impression? Dude, every single time he opens his mouth, but I can't get it down. I don't know why. Why? Why? <laughs> oh my days. Yeah, that one's. I went wide again? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to do this. <laughs> it's still 1-1. One, one. It's 1.53. How long have we been going for? Has this been 20 minutes? More? What? This has been a bit of a drawn out game. Still knotted at one. Oh! Brandon, oh! oh! Five hole. Five hole on Brandon! What was that song? Was it a Salah? Salah. 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 Like, like there we go. Eat, salad. Like, what do you eat? <laughs> salad. Salad. We pronounce it Salah. So that's 2-1, Titus and KB. They take the lead again. I, I thought it was 2-1, Big Cat and Brandon earlier. Nope, it was only 1-1. One, one. So that goal puts Titus and KB in the lead. They nutmeg Brandon. Mm. And oh, now... Anyway. Yeah. Hey. Oh. Successful broadcast. Oh. Oh, KB almost knocked it in. Oh, wait, is that going to go in for KB? Oh, oh my God. Count it, count it, count it. Count it, count Does it. that count? <laughs> KB just kicked it in Why? unintentionally from across the, the court, and it went straight past Big Cat. I don't know if that's going to count. I guess not. Uh, nope. Stephen Jay, the ref. Come on, win this, Kyle. 2-1 is still the score. They're not going to count that one, even though it was very impressive. Fraudulent ref. Oh, that's going right into the axe. Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> KB just threw the ball right into the, the yak. Ball. Pretty much right where he sits on the yak every single day. That was not even close. He goes from Trizzy. Great fit by Spider today. What happened? Shut up, this. Oh, yeah, that was a good event creation. It's a little wide right. Well... Right. Big Cat with a chance to tie it right here. Oh. He goes overhead yes. once again. Are they going to count that? If Jay counts this, he's the most paid rap of all time. Yep, they're going to count that. Oh, he counted it. That was overhead, <laughs> took one bounce, and went straight past Mark in the air. Uh, there was one earlier that was like that, and we didn't count it, but Jay is going to count it. So now we're at 2-2. Yep. Oh, we might need to heckle the ref a little. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can say that on Rumble, but... <laughs> All right, 2-2. Two, two. Next goal wins, TJ? Is that what we I think doing? Big Cat just said win by two. Oh, shit. <laughs> we might be going for a while, folks. Yeah. Titus taking his time, trying to misdirect Big Cat and Brandon with a couple bounces. <laughs> I love that. Over there. Oh. I love that. I think I was good old, good old yeah. shit, Alzheimer. Great comms by that, Brandon. Man. It's over there. Yeah. I still can't get over Che asking, can they hear? <laughs> <laughs> As if a blindfold <laughs> would in any way affect if they can hear. Was he talking about us in here? Or could they hear I, us? I think he was saying, can they hear the ball? I'm like, oh, yeah, great probably. Save. My boy's defense. Uh, they hear our company. Yeah, true, true, true. Uh, I want this to be over. I, I'm, I'm tired. I'm sweating. <laughs> My knees hurt. Liam. Liam. I was about to throw in the cut. Going horizontal with the foam there. For what reason? No idea. Oh, KB, that's a good strike, but it's going to go sailing right. So no goal there. Still knotted up at two. Now we got a crowd going in the upper decks. They got bored. There was more people before. I think they have it. They have it on on the screen. There is a screen. Yeah, I don't know what that's, that screen. That's what they're watching. 
Big Cat angles himself up perfectly in the oh, middle geez. of the floor. Yes, that's probably his worst throw today, right? Botches it. Yeah. Tried to fold it. Yeah, they've lost interest. <laughs> they've lost interest in the upper decks. Here we go, Titus. Oh! I feel like, I feel like what? I'm so slow. How is it right every time? That one was looking good until the very last second, too. What's it right every time? Fuck! I'm pretty sure Brandon just touched Spider on the ass unintentionally. Brandon, you need the ball? Yeah. All right, Brandon now on his approach. Who's got the ball? Well, that could be good. Stop! Oh, what a save. What a save. He was going bottom right corner once again. That got Liam very excited. <laughs> God, win this. Please. What a character. Please, All right. Kyle. KB, I wasn't even close. Okay. Yeah, straight to Spider, as Stephanie just pointed out. I don't know. I don't know what Liam is filming. What? <laughs> why is he going horizontal on his yeah, phone? Yeah, which platform? None. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice shot, Big Cat. Oh, Big Cat. He chucks oh, that one in as a just like a relief pitcher. Oh, oh Titus, oh, quick oh, roll, oh, quick roll. Oh, oh, what a head off guard, game. but Big Cat keeps the game alive. Takes the body. Yeah, oh, he's gassed. These, these, these players are fatigued. Gassed. Brandon. Could be good. Straight down the middle, but no, it's stopped by Titus. Titus has a ton of saves. Yeah, the stats for him have to Titus be. Titus might have a double double. Wait, what was it? MVP maybe? Yeah, what's the second double there, TJ? <laughs> <laughs> Do I have to explain uh, all the rules of this game? <laughs> KB has lost a shoe. It looks like he's trying to use his shoe as a way of angling up his shot. That's genius. And it worked! It worked! And that's, oh! KB! And that's what makes him one of the best players. With the game winner! That's some innovation. And that's why he wins goal ball games. Oh, yes. Goes right between Brandon and Big Cat after he angles the shot up with his shoe. And KB and Titus are going to win it 3-2. to two. What a match. Where were you, folks? <laughs> Where were you? On his birthday, no less. Happy yep. birthday, KB. It's only right. It was written. Shut it down. Yeah, there was, there was a script for yep. goal ball, whatever script it was. Leak. <laughs> how, how bad was that to watch? Was that was incredible. KB did one of the most athletic things I've ever seen anyone ever do in my life. I want to see a couple replays. Did anybody get mousetrapped? I got, I kicked oh, there was one. Oh, there I, I was trying. There was one in yeah, front of Titus for like 10 minutes. Did you see how I'm sweating so much right now? Look at what KB did. <sighs> Holy hell. Wait, say, do it again. Show it again. It, it's, it hasn't That's happened not, yet. That was just a mousetrap. What is Spider doing? They would not stop Steve standing in front of the camera. Oh, oh my god, KB! <laughs> I cannot not believe that word. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! That's incredible! <laughs> Holy That's shit! Insane. That was best case scenario. Holy shit! The head save. That was so. Hard. I'm literally like. That was fun, dude. I'm disoriented like crazy. Well, there's no skill involved. Oh, well, I mean, I it's easy for you to say because you lost, but. Can we I see a couple we other highlights? Because I Titus feel, had like 15 saves. I feel yeah. like you did. Every yeah. time I took a shot, I was offline, but it's like we're standing right. Yeah, Che. Every time I threw it, Che would go, "Ooh, wide yeah, right." I was so, like, "How could it be wide right?" Big Cat, you you How? you were like lining your back up. Never get close. Where I just slowly. Down. Yeah, you yeah, the sneak. Well, the overheads went what were like. That's not fair. Yeah, what were you, <laughs> you were trying some. You, you, kept like, you kept lining your back up to the goalpost to make sure you were straight and then turning completely. Wait, I want to see that because I was so frustrating. I thought I was so frustrating. I thought I was just shooting it yeah. straight every time, and it just never was there. Was that electric, TJ? I thought it was fun. Okay. I think we need wider goals. Yeah, the goals that they play with are like the length, yeah, the width of the room that they're in. So, like, you can't not Yeah, hit so the we goal. need that and, like, the, yeah. Yeah. I'm really sweating. Whew. That was fun. Really fun.
Except oh. very, it was very disorienting. I want to see some highlights because I have no idea what we look like. All right, so this is me. He's going to fake anybody out. Finding the middle. Oh, Connor was doing commentary. Oh, big cat do, taking defense on. I was putting mouse traps, traps around you guys. Ball, yeah, we figured. Yep. See, there he goes. I wasn't even. I think he's still missing. I think it's still outside his left leg. See, I was doing that. Oh, I was so offline. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you guys. <laughs> so that would have worked. <laughs> You guys never heard it. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I never heard if it. I was just even close to being online, I would have been able to do that. This is uh, very funny. Oh my God, that's that is so wide. Yeah, right. so wide. Every time I was getting yeah. so frustrated. I don't understand. It felt like I was throwing it right down the middle every time. I uh, pretty much cheated to win. How? I looked. Oh, Titus, nice. Bound, <laughs> but <laughs> but off KB. Oh, this is earlier in the game when we were laying down. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to squeak the shoes. No idea what's happening. Get a little. <laughs> oh no! Oh, shit. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> what a sport! What a That's sport! That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, if we get wider goals, this could be electric. Right now, I want to like dive for it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, look at the stupid attack. That. that could slip right through the middle. Oh, oh Kyle. Last second save by KV. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot of fun. It yeah, was. Yeah, we're going to refine that, and we'll get yeah. – we got to find really wide I, goals. I do wonder what the rules are on how you throw. Yeah, we got to learn hard the rules. or, like, yeah. how, how well, many bounces. In, like, the Olympic something. one, they're doing, like, a kickball, like, spinning wind-up throw. They're, they're throwing it pretty hard you can throw and, like, hard. pretty bouncy. I think it just has to be underhand. Yeah, I threw one that was over yeah. my head. <laughs> yeah, you drilled me in the yeah, shoulder. One bounce. <laughs> Can we see that where I hit him? That was, oh, man. <laughs> I might be addicted to this game. Oh, I love it. We just got to find wide, wide goals. And I think they got to be short, too. I don't know how to get better at, like, spatial. Um, yeah, I think no. we need some timeouts in the middle, too, so you could at least take the blindfold off. Yeah, see where yourself. you are. Because I was Brandon, you're playing good defense. Motion sickness. Well, I was just stationary. All saves were if they threw it right at me. Oh, man. Who was the leading goal scorer? Which guys? Which of you scored two goals? He scored two. I, I no, scored one. Oh. I honestly don't remember. <laughs> I don't. You guys had two? Did you guys both score? Yeah. We both scored, yeah. yeah. Both scored. Titus, your strategy at the end was very good where you did, like, the kicker. Like, you kind of spaced yourself out to the middle, like, of the free throw line. Yeah. You scored a goal on that. Yeah, I want to see I want to see my one of my goals. I wanna... <laughs> oh, <laughs> Titus just got pegged. Titus just got pegged. <laughs> I just... <laughs> I, might have, I might go back and watch the whole thing. Yeah, I know. I want to see all of it. The funniest ones are definitely, though, the, the slow rollers where you can't hear it. Yeah. yeah. You're just flailing. <laughs> oh, man. That was fun. All what right. What a game. Yeah, Happy birthday, right. Kyle. Oh, Happy birthday, boys. Kyle. No, that's all you wanted when you woke up this morning. Was <laughs> that was play honestly, blind whatever ball. What a birthday. Blind ball so toss with the boys. Yeah. All right, let's spin our wheel, TJ. We reset yesterday. Oh, nice. It's huge. <laughs> all right, so next week... Last week before Super Bowl. Yeah. I'm going to watch that back. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling yeah, Connor Griffin was very good on commentary. Yeah, hopefully people enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah. I think it would be great if we just got goals that were as wide as the court. Yeah. And then you played like three or four. I mean, that's incredible. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can we get this on ESPN, like on uh, Sports Center tonight? Uh, seriously. He went right to the ball. <laughs> <laughs> what uh, yeah, the that, fuck? Honestly, yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> Tip of the cap to me. <laughs> that was sick. Oh man! God damn! That was incredible, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> that is. Yeah. I don't know. That's yeah. worth being on yeah. Sports Center yeah. top ten. That's I mean, it was a, he was illegal outside the goal box. But. Yeah. Oh man! All right. Thank you, everyone. Happy birthday, Kyle. Thank you so much. Appreciate everyone. Sup subscribe, please. We will refine that and get it to be uh, something special. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's a future. Yeah, I think we two have one, two, and then we'll normally have two other guys yeah. who can be on the mics yakking.
I yeah. think with bigger goals and three on three, though, could play. It's just such a hilarious game to see us just yeah. flailing blind. I know. It's a good idea starter. We'll get it. I'm so frustrated yeah. myself, though, because I know that all my shots, like, I thought were great, and they just were all off. Yeah. Same. I was just turning, <laughs> TJ, at the last So time. frustrating. Wide right. Way like, wide right. Yeah, you would set up your shoulders square, and then you'd kind of turn your whole body and then throw <laughs> it wherever. <laughs> KB, you threw one into the studio. Yes. Yeah, that was crazy. <laughs> How did that happen? I don't know. I've never been blind. I think the other part of this the game is you got to go like faster paced, where it's like like mm -hmm. just keep going. Yeah. yeah. There should be a clock. Yeah. Yeah. Because it was it, that was actually the thrill is like not knowing when the ball was coming. There should be more than one ball, not like an active at. But, like, when we throw it and it goes wide, instead of retrieving it, someone should have just handed just hand you a ball, ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. as they're going to get the other one. And just go. And just go that way. We'll perfect this. Yeah. This will be the greatest sport we've ever played. Incredible. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, see everyone on Monday. Have a great weekend. Hey, everybody have a good weekend. Stay safe out there. And remember, there's lots of chatter in this world about worth, work ethic and this and that. It's always been the yak. Have a good weekend. Love you guys. Bye.